I'm ready. Yep. I'm blacker than the ace of spades and more militant than you and your whole damn army put together. Why you out there chanting that rally, proud beating politicians? I'm taking out any money from the sucker on a humble that gets in my way. So I'll tell you what. When your so-called revolution starts, you call me, and I'll be right down front showing you how it's done. But until then, you need to shut the fuck up when grown folks is talking. Now, can you dig it? Ladies, gentlemen, and scholars, the world's first quantum repair podcast live from the Daddy Juice Energy Studio in the Beaded Curtain District. Your star players, Gemini Jackson and Arthur Dude. Welcome, welcome, ladies, gentlemen, and of course, you scholars. I'm your fearless and greasy host, Gemini Jackson, somewhere in the quantum in a world with one quarter of four dudes in a booth, Arthur Dude. Howdy, ninjas. Fox Trot and the Burrito Bandito join us via Jitsi on the other side of the glow hill, but first, a word from our sponsors. Stop wasting your time messing around with old glass jars and dollar store balloons. Jenkin pods are concentrated pods filled with the juice that will make you loose. <laughs> Oh man, Titan <laughs> Titan oh, Nanometer Technology ensures a perfect dose of dynamite and dookie fills your lungs to have you feeling pooforia with every drag. Available wherever you get your pods. Jenkin Pods. Batteries sold separately. Pooforia. I'm going to make shirts that just have this. It's the P? Pooforia. No, just like the four down. Four, four down. Uh, four, four down. down. Four down. <laughs> You gotta throw it like that. Pooforia. 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 Shit. All right, guys. Yeah, it's a new gang. Did it double X quantum? No, 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 no. Reflections on my kitchen wrist and twisting. Hey, man. Only hey. five times a day, dude. Only. You don't want to hurt your wrist. Once in the kitchen. That's why you switch it. You know. It's too much. You load. gotta switch it. It's too much load, and then sometimes you lonely sandwich. You know what I mean? I was thinking about that. <laughs> you were That's thinking probably about, about the number sandwich. three or number four. Yeah, when you really gotta like grease the wheels, you know. When you just you know, cough up chips dust, with it. chips with your lonely sandwich. That's why it's not lonely. I got chips. No, the only chips you have with lonely sandwich are fucking Fritos. Do you eat them just before, Fritos? during, Fritos or after? Chili at least, or just plain no, old Fritos? No, just plain old Fritos. The corn plain chips. Old Fritos. Man. No, not like... even the scoops. Not even anything to dip it in. Just plain ass corn chip Cheetos. What's What's the drink? Nothing. Sand. Nothing. You sand. get to drink sand. I'll just take the Fritos then, nope. fucker. You asked for a drink, bitch. <laughs> nah, no, man. Yeah, fuck here's that. a nice this is a horrible glass deal. This is a fucking horrible deal. Wait, look, this, this is, is the only thing shot. you get with a lonely sandwich. This it comes with a side shot, of Fritos man. and a fucking large cup of sand. A large cup of sand? A large cup of Shove sand. Shove that up your ass. Damn, bro. This is the apocalypse, Damn. man. That's the fucking That's value menu happen, in the apocalypse, man. dude. <laughs> One cup of sand? Up One cup ass. of sand, a lonely sandwich, Fritos corn chips, and a large cup of sand. That's Those are the, combos one, two, and three. That's the post-apocalyptic combo, combo meal. Speaking of combo yeah. meals, what do you usually get? I heard you get the number yeah, five. Yeah, I, I had this, I, like, the other day I was thinking, I was like, what, what combo meal do I usually order at places I frequent? Is it always the same number or is it not? Oh, you were trying to draw some conclusions. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why. Damn, you were trying to things. read the motherfucking signs? Well, I heard that, you know, oh, uh, the apocalypse is going to happen next oh, year shit. pretty soon. So I got to, like, kind of think about the these things trying that are to steal my shit? They're on my bucket list to think about. He's trying so to become I'm just thinking fucking about it. Foxtrot the Prophet. <laughs> no, it's be. not Foxtrot the Prophet. It's Fox. It's, it's Foxtrophet. That's mm. an OnlyFans site. Damn. <laughs> Forge slash Foxtrot? I bet there is an OnlyFans for slash Fox. It's gotta be, right? Yeah. And she has like a tail. Hell yeah. But like it's Hell yeah. real. It's Years. just it's nope. a real tail. It's a Shut real tail. No, up. it's just her tailbone got oh, her shit, coax dude. got distended. <laughs> like extended. Wow. She got an this implant. Is, no, no, no. This is yeah, a real I'm condition. Implant. I'm more digging nope. like implant, like this cyberpunk. Is a real condition. Like, nope. real. Right. This that's is a real I'm condition. Th- no. No. Let's say it's not a real condition for a burrito. Let's say she got an implant. Would you consider that hot? Yeah. Wait, what? You know how people get like rings implanted in their forehead or like. Yeah. So she got a tail implanted? Yeah. Yeah. In her. Is it fuzzy? I don't know. No, it could be whatever you want, dude. I don't think Christ. hair really grows there. So maybe they'd have to get it hair. It would just implanted. be like skin. 
and, and then like, uh, but she would dress it up like a wig or something. Peach, she would dress it like, up. Like if she got naked, oh, it would just be like a naked tail. Crazy. Tarot. Yeah. See, this is the this is the exact opposite of what Dude, you want. I know what he's going to look at future. No, this is the opposite of what. No, this is the triple X quantum. No, check this out. Check this out, guys. This is checking. This is the exact opposite of what you want. It should be naked in the front and hair in the back. Yeah, that's the way. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm imagining. But this is just naked all around, so it's like a a, a sphinx cat. But that what if you uh, what if I you tie fur? No, I want no, no, fur no. on it because it looks cute. No, but how long would socks. the stub be? How she long has would it be? socks that she puts a regular it, size like a, tail. It, Dogs it, it, come she with has, different sized tails. She has fuzzy attachments. It could just a be like that, a little nub. That she can wear. It <laughs> I could don't be want like this That's long. Or she, she wears like these. No, she wears yeah, like these. like a curly tail. She wears these. It's just a long you know, tail. You know that character I mean, it's, it's in Dark, uh, dark uh, 11 and a half dark inches. Stalkers, the kitty cat. She wears yeah. it as Her. attaching to an implant? She had a tail like that. Maybe it's like 27 inches, this tail. That's fine. Like a lion's tail? It's fully articulate. It better be. But Is this like Avatar? It's naked. Like Avatar, but like, I mean, why I'm are just you asking. The naked no, part because so no, hard. Why is because that? Because burritos. That's what he's stuck on. He oh, has no imagination. He has zero imagination. He was talking about OnlyFans. Well, let's just ask burrito, burrito, what, what, what do you want, burrito? Like, what do you want it to like? I wasn't talking about anything. No. If this was the advancement no, of the human we're species, you, guys, where you could get. We're all asking the wrong tail questions. implants. Yes, exactly. Yes. No, 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 <laughs> no. But they didn't grow any hair unless no, the hair already grew no, there. Guys. So you would put hair implants on there. No, you don't wait. Put hair. No, why would you put hair implants? It'd be like a human hair tail. <laughs> yeah. You don't, what? Isn't that what you're trying to achieve? No, tails are like completely different texture because it's like animal fur. <laughs> yeah, I want animal fur. See? Yeah, like, I want animal want, fur. Like, not you, you no, like no, this. not hair. No, that's Dude. totally different. You gotta I want condition it, to feel it like with mane and tail. Nice. No, it, animal hair is different, soft. man. You don't want human it's hair. It's fluffy. You don't want long, it big just... hair. No, okay. Here was the real question. You got this banging chick, right? But she got a tail. A real ass tail, 27 inches. And it's naked. But she understands cosplay. She dresses it up for you whenever you want. Still true or false? True. That's a no brainer. It's Why not on you, dude. Yeah. It's on the burrito. True or false? Yeah, that's true. I got a follow up to that. Yeah. What costumes would she wear? Well, lots of costumes. Just give me yeah. three. Um, like I would have her dress up like a normal ass bitch without a tail because we always want what we don't have. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude. <laughs> Next. No, what's the next one, man? Come on, man. Don't be like that. They got feelings too and shit. No, what are you talking about? That's like, that's the truest. That's the truest. The truest that's why the everybody's truest. laughing because man, that hit so God. hard because it was true. He's out of the bottle, man. That's true. That's like that's true. the, that's the uh, definition of a fantasy. <laughs> because you can't live like that fantasy life. You can't just constantly have orgies. You just fucking, I mean, you get you're right, Jim. You, you would just be sitting in the corner man. like I, eating a fucking. I come to this podcast. You would eat nachos in the middle of I an orgy. I come to this podcast yeah. to escape reality. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I dropped <laughs> it a little real. too hard. I dropped it a little too hard. I gave you the exact definition of a fantasy. So come <laughs> along and ride on the. <laughs> so answer the question. Fantastic boy. Answer the question. What did you have? Yeah, yeah, we're waiting Wait, for you, the, dude. Cosplay. Wait, you know what the question was? Oh we just gosh, needed three man. costumes, man. No. Oh, you need three? Okay. Well, I don't know. Like, pick three different down. fucking animals. Godzilla, Chung Lee, and... What? <laughs> and Godzilla there would be a Godzilla. Chun- we just call oh, one out. Dude, That's Godzilla. a top number one. That's the most votes. Ooh, dude, Stegosaurus. Damn, I never really thought about that. I never really thought about that. Right? Really thought about that. right? And huh. then with, the, yeah, with the, so. the spikes all the way up. And she has got a hoodie. Yeah. Would those be implants? No, they're That's not like cute. real on them. I guess. She's, it's costumes. <laughs> An implant on the implant. <laughs> it's costumes. Oh, gotcha. What are you talking about? These are costumes. Like, yeah. And it's like plush. A plush okay. stegosaurus? Like, or a, yeah. yeah, a plushy stegosaurus. It's not like, like Barney? Yeah. Yeah. Barney's not a stegosaurus. Like, a, like, like one of those little, I mean, his like, costume like a little kigurumi. Fabric. You want Barney? Yeah. He want he want Barney. <laughs> you want Barney? Barney. <laughs> what? You want Barney? <laughs> you want to dress up as no, Barney? I said, Dude, I, I took like my headphones off and just put them on, and that's like the thing. The I only thing I you like, heard, Barney. I was like, you want her to dress no, up I said like, like Barney, a, like a little kigurumi. Yeah, I know. But then you said like for like, your but third I didn't wish, say Barney. For your third wish, <laughs> you want her to dress up like Barney. 
<laughs> I didn't say that. Man, you fucking weird. But Not like, hey, said, but like, we asked. That's on us. We asked. Yeah, that's, that's on us, us man. That's Damn, on us. my bad. <laughs> like, you wanted to escape realness. And I, I, now I have to live in it, huh? So Barney Which Stegosaurus Bar- is Barney one. Barney Stegosaurus. Give me another one. Venture yeah. out there. Um, a fox. A fox. Sure. sure. But a special kind of fox. Yeah, of course. Like a white fox? From the forest. A red fox? Like a Michael like a J. Fox? Snow fox? A Michael J. Fox? <laughs> you want to dress you up as Michael J. Fox? <laughs> yeah, dude. We like the other shit. Yeah, man, this is some fucked up weird this shit. This is crazy. Uh, but we like, asked. Back, back to the future best <laughs> Dude, we asked. Yeah, we, yeah, we, we asked. Just the back of the future on us. on the Nikes. Yeah, it's on us, <laughs> But we asked, okay, so that's... Man, this that's is crazy. Us. You gotta burn the book, man. Burn the almanac! That was on us, man. So what about the third one? Yeah, what is it? He said the third one. <laughs> oh, no, give us one more. Like um, a lion or something? How about, how about a shark? Shark? Okay. Hmm. That's a kind of weird tail, that's though, a weird right? one, man. What the, you want to fuck yeah. a shark? Don't you still want a humanoid <laughs> figure with a tail? Like, yeah, like, I mean, uh, what do you do? Like, like a cool. shark with legs? Is this like left <laughs> shark? <laughs> I think he wants You want left <laughs> shark? You want to just shark? Like, when you can have Katy Perry with a tail, you want left shark. <laughs> <laughs> but that's on you. We have, that's it, we have. That's cool, that's on man. Us. That's on us. Those are interesting choices. <laughs> yeah, those are interesting choices, man. Those aren't even my choices. <laughs> that's You're what the I one heard. saying them. I got a witness. Yeah, me too. You're the he one saying them. Give him a questions, witness. Man. And I said, hey, I'll witness. Testify. I said, testify. He said, Stegosaurus. More specifically, Barney, Barney Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus. <laughs> Barney. Number two, he said, Fox. Specifically, Bar- Michael, Michael J. J. Fox. Fox. And third, I heard shark. And specifically, left yes, shark. shark. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's on us. We asked. We asked. I like those answers, though. I'll agree yeah, with that. I don't know about the Michael J. Fox, but hey. They're good answers. The best. They're honest the best. answers. Speaking of Michael J. Fox, how's your poster restoration going, Burrito? Uh, I haven't done anything with it. Hmm. But I did think get some mail. Oh, you got mail? Know. I did get some mail. Which I think you guys like. Burrito's only fan mail. Oh, we got Burrito's only fan mail. Oh, we have an unboxing on podcast. Kind of a halfway unbox it. Here we go. Oh, it's our record. It's a record. What? It's uh, nice, the record dude. that you showed on the thing. Identify. Oh, that's Cowboy uh, Bebop. Yeah, this Cowboy is the, Bebop. the vinyl. Bebop. That shit's hot uh, shit, dude. Uh, vinyl. That's hot, dog. That's hot shit. That's like something you could play at a fucking high-end coffee That's so hot. Be careful, man. It's wax. Right. You know? Yeah, not too it's hot. Nice. It's wax. It's pretty nice. And it's the uh, Swordfish 2 and Red Tail edition. So Ooh. one of these is... Uh, Remix. Tra- translucent. Red v- marble vinyl, and the other one is translucent purple marble vinyl. Nice, and you'll never know because you'll never open it. I open we'll all up, our records. I'll play them. Yeah, I, I, open you, them I play know them. you play your records. I know yeah. you play your records. Like this. You know? Crazy shit like that. What's on that soundtrack? It's just jazz, dude. Yeah, mm-hmm. but it's more specifically. Psycho jazz. <laughs> Name Psycho. drops. Uh, I don't uh, know. Like, tank? I don't know. Yeah, Tank. <laughs> tank. And Kitty Katana. And uh, Michael J. Fox. <laughs> You're an asshole. You need to sit your little sexy ass thing. All right, Burrito. Oh, looks like, all right, all right Foxtrot. You, you ran through the entirety of the boys. Oh yeah, I liked it, man. It was Ooh. really good. It's fucking really good. Solid. Can't tell wait us, for the third season. Tell us all about it, man. Before you tell us all about it, I'm going to describe a specific scene, but not oh, all the way. Not all the way. Thank you for bringing this up. But I want you to tell me about it without spoiling it. All right? So they're at mm. the uh, the mental institution. The Vought compound. And it's just site. gone chaos in there. Yeah, with all the test subjects. All the test subjects. One of the test subjects breaks the glass on a door. Do you know what part I'm talking about? It's it, that... Uh, it involves Mother's uh, Milk. This character escapes from that place, right? It's that character? No, yeah, he doesn't escape. This character dies, actually. That's not the it's spoiler, not a he. Though. It's not a he, it's a she. No. no. That's a he. No. <laughs> that's not what you're <laughs> thinking about. I'm thinking oh, about I'm the thinking one minute that I mentioned in a while. That's a very big clue. It's a he. 
I don't remember because it was like two weeks ago. Dude, you, remember remember this this you remember this part. I know you remember, you remember this part. You remember this part. Okay. <laughs> part no, no. Chill, chill. Uh, Let's dude, just focus. I can't. Let's just focus. Mother's Milk, right? You know who Mother's Milk is? Yeah, I remember Mother's Milk, yeah. All right. They're and, it's one of the boys. They're breaking into the test subject compound, right? Right. MM's there with... Um, I can't remember, dude. I'm sorry. Butcher? <laughs> okay, Butcher. Yeah, Butcher. No, is that Butcher what the boys and Butcher wasn't Starlight. there. Butcher was with... Butcher was with his wife at that point. But it had the the Japanese girl, Starlight, Mother's Starlight. Milk, Frenchie. Frenchie was there. And uh, what's the main character's name? Brett. I don't know. Um, they were all there at that compound trying to scope it out, right? And they all get bum-rushed because um, everybody's, like, panicking, right? The, all the people, all the test subjects are running around. So they barricade themselves in a door, but something blasts through the glass. Like breaks the glass on the door. Breaks the glass on oh, the door. Oh, dude, I don't remember, man. Wow. Don't let, me, sorry. let me tell them what, the next part. That's a little too much. Going, XJ. I don't spoiling it. Yeah, go ahead. I don't remember. And then Mother Milk gets Mother's Milk gets choked. choked. Man, you I didn't must watch the show. I must, have, I must have missed that part. I don't Man. remember. Wow, dude, you missed yeah. the best part of the entire show. <laughs> really? I, I, it was a there microcosm. was a lot of really that was the no, one minute that made the show. You didn't even watch the show then. Really? I don't <laughs> yeah. remember it. No, when you see this <laughs> clip, when you see this then? clip, wait, what should I search then? Oh, let me see if I can find it on Prime right now for you. You guys can carry on the con- discussion, which is Edward. Wait, what season Gimble. is it? Season, season two. two. Mother's Milk's only season Prime. two. And it involves Liberty I know, I'm trying to find like the timestamp for you. Was. You remember that character? Wait, I'm sorry. I'm not paying attention to you, man. No. The character Liberty. <laughs> I'm on a mission now. Or, I forgot what her hero name Liberty. was. Liberty. That's what Liberty? her old, old hero name was, but her new hero name, I can't remember. Oh, uh, Storm something. Yeah. Storm She's like a Storm character. Front. Something Storm like that. Front. Storm yeah. Front. Yeah, dude. I don't remember. So did you guys think about Eduardo Tiempo, Time Bandito anymore? I'm gonna. Those are those sorry, dudes. I'm gonna private message this to you, dude. Okay, thanks. Oh, we're gonna have. Right, a, yeah, good. yeah it's, we're gonna have a little wa- watch party. Reaction on a podcast. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna have a watch party. Um, I don't see it. No, no. I, All right, I'll just, just wait. wait, dude, just wait. Right, yeah, you can talk about the next thing, and while I receive this article through the so internet. So I had an idea for the arch, one of the arch enemies of the Time Bandito. Yeah. What is it? But I feel like this character was already like the name the for the character. The Time been Bandito. Used. That Wait. has nothing to do with time. It's just like an enemy. No. Cross oh yeah, other this part. This part. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I remember now. <laughs> I must have like totally forgot yeah, about now. it. But I just, I just want to say, I'll just say one word. Yeah. Sausage. So, okay. <laughs> okay. Spoiler alert. It's not a spoiler. That's not too bad of a spoiler. That's not a spoiler at all. No, it's not. Where are you at with the boys' burrito? He hasn't started. I haven't started it. Uh, it's oh, once watching. you start though, it's you can't stop. You can't get stop. Hooked, man. You, can't like stop. you gotta just man. watch it all. Yeah, yeah. I guess like I couldn't. Um, I must have just forgot about this part mm. just because it was so funny. Mm. It was ridiculous. You were laughing so much. You you passed yeah, out. Yeah, I was died. laughing a lot at this part. You passed I do out. Remember and died. now? The ticking time bandito. Dido, Dido, Dido. Oh, so this arch enemy. Uh huh. He's just called Vector. Right, because he goes forward and backward. He has no actual position in time. Right, what? he's a single point, and he can go anywhere at any time. Oh, so like the arch enemy is a time travel because of the name. He's a vector. It has velocity and time. <laughs> That's a vector. Vector, it's, like Vector yeah. Man. That's a video game. No, it's just, no, just vector. vector. With oh. a K. Yeah. And a zero. <laughs> okay. Oh, because he's like. <laughs> How Russian. original do I have to make this? He's Russian because it was Victor. Oh, no, that's I his see, real name. Yeah, Victor something. Yeah, of course. Victor Timonov. <laughs> Timonov. <laughs> no, better. Victor well, Timonov. Okay. Actually, no, that sounds pretty good. That's yeah, awesome. Victor like Timonov, the Vector. With a K. Yeah. Victor <laughs> Vector, Vector Timonov. <laughs> <laughs> uh, tell me about, so he can just blip through time? Yeah. Kind of like my teleport power? But instead, of, no, no, no. His is just time teleportation. So it's the same place, but he can like blip through. So... Imagine you're standing in the middle of downtown Slam City in 1862, mm-hmm. right? It's just land. So he can go there, but it's in the same place that he's standing currently. How does that go with his name? He's a vector. Is that what a vector is? <laughs> yeah, it's like a position. Yeah, it really doesn't matter because it's, it's spelled a position with a K. It that, could just mean anything. And it yeah, means the arch enemy. This is exactly what Edward it is, man. This is Wardo exactly Tenepo. what it is. It's a, it's, a, it's a point that has a direction. And speed, I believe. 
So in one of the issues, there's an opening graphic of the like Windows 3.1 hourglass, yeah. all like Ding. pixelated up yeah. close and yeah. at an angle. Right. So it kind of looks cool, like it's yeah. You can perspective see the, on the page. You can see the pixels. Yeah, you know what LCD. it is. Yeah. And then it backs out, and Eduardo Tiempo's or Crystal Quartz, one of them, uh-huh. is that like a computer with a full size monitor? Uh huh. And looking up something on the internet, and this is how it gets into the uh, vector issue. Okay, so they're looking in the internet, and they discover Victor Taimanov. What is he? Is he? He's a Russian scientist. All right. Right? Who is experimenting with time travel, but only got certain vectors correct. But now he's... I don't know what he's going to do, man. He can do anything. He's like, it's too broad. I feel like it's too broad, because it's just like... Okay, so he's Russian. Does he have a costume? Yeah, it's red. He's the Flash. It's it's the it's the Flash's costume, but instead of a lightning bolt, it's a V. All right. It looks like check marks pointing backwards, right? No. And it and, and it connects here, so it's just a big V. I feel like the look of the Flash has been used across the board with a bunch of different characters. Yeah, but he's a bad guy. Yeah. The Flash is a good guy. Is he? Yeah. He doesn't have to be. But he is. That's Wait, what makes is Vector him a good, guy. a good guy or bad guy? What no, is Vector's he? a bad guy. Vector's a bad guy. The Flash. Now you're talking about the Flash. Flash is a good guy. Wait, true or false? <laughs> I don't know, man. I guess the Flash so. is a good is, guy. Is good? Okay, so Flash is a good guy, right? Okay. Yes. Okay, thank you. Has he ever been a bad guy? Yeah, in like uh, no. Red Red Flash. No. Red Zoom. Flash. Mountain Dew. Red Zone. Zoom. No. Zo- Zoom is the Reverse Flash. That's a stupid ass name. <laughs> I fucking hate uh, it. <laughs> <laughs> and he's so the yellow. Flash is arch oh enemy. Oh my god! Yeah, he's he's just the Flash is arch enemy. Okay, so it's so, Professor Zoom. Zoom. So Vector. Professor Zoom. Uh huh. He's the and he's just wearing Flash. a yellow outfit. Yellow with red, right? Red accents. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Yeah. I fucking yeah. hate that. <laughs> so Vector. Zoom, man, <laughs> stupid. Okay, so what was Zoom shit? What? Why would he like doing the things that he did? Why he went nefarious? Yeah. What was Zoom's motivating uh, factors? Oh, he's not really nefarious I think he per was... se. It depends on how you look at it. If you're looking at it from like an American, then it's like a cyber attack. But if you're looking at it from his Federation's perspective, he's like a hero. Yeah, I know. But that's exactly what I was asking him. But you didn't specify anything. You just said that the perspective was exactly what we already established. Of the hourglass? No. Yo, what's Victor. happening here, man? What's going I'm on? To, I am. I'm <laughs> okay. actually trying to ask the burrito. What? What, what the burrito? Are you saying anything, man? What zoom? Because Arthur was just talking about some shit. I was okay. talking about Vector. What is Zoom? <laughs> yeah, I thought we were talking about Vector, man. What is talking zoom? about Vector and the, I'm trying and to zoom. rip Zoom off exactly. What's Zoom's <laughs> oh, motivating yeah. factor? See, damn, just um, let me work. <laughs> what's his he ulterior hates- motive? <laughs> Not his uh, ulterior motive. That's not his motive factor. Uh, wait, why was Zoom? What is nefarious? his motive? Not his ulterior motive. His he's, motive. He's jealous of the Flash. Oh, and so fuck. He, that's it. He got, so he, he becomes got, a bad oh, guy because he's jealous. Oh, I got it now. Yeah, Victor was at the Izakaya. Victor was at the he's Izakaya. From the future. There you go. Victor was at the Izakaya, and he he's, wanted to yeah, chat up uh, Crystal. Damn so, quartz. Oh shit! So, Victor so wanted to holler oh, okay. at Crystal. There's a love quartz. twist going on here. Yeah, and she was like playing him. Oh, maybe that's his wife, though. <laughs> what? And Eduardo wants a piece of that? <laughs> no, Eduardo's like hitting it, like throughout time, like forever. They're soulmates, but in this specific time frame, Crystal didn't find him in time, so she went with fucking Victor. <laughs> There's only one person Victor. that can tell us what's going on. Mr. Cleo, you bitch. <laughs> Say the name, bitch. Mr. Cleo, 7 foot hey, 11. Hey, man, is the world really going to end next year? <laughs> you goddamn bet. Damn, Mr. This Cleo grew months. another 11 inches after we first he's, started talking about him. He's 7 foot 18. <laughs> that sounds ridiculous. <laughs> you <are>, dumb bitch. <laughs> those are two measurements. <laughs> Bullshit. What's in meters? How much is that? 25 meters. <laughs> 25 and a half meters. Those are two measurements. <laughs> so Victor was yeah. jealous Vector. of Eduardo. This is before he became the Vector. Yeah. Okay, so the Izakai is where uh, Crystal tells him that she's leaving him. And like 
Victor assumes is because of Eduardo because he go he goes back to the Izakaya to try to get uh, Crystal back. Oh, he did there. some failed time travel where in that parallel he fucked up, and Eduardo yeah. got Crystal Quartz. Yeah, and now he has to live in that time. But now line. he's back in the normal time, right? And he's all twisted because of what he knows or what he thinks he knows in this parallel future. So he's trying to stop Eduardo from meeting Crystal. That's why he's a bad guy. But that's like a good motivator, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, yeah. It's, yeah. Okay. There's a good I character like in the book right there. So let's talk about Mr. Cleo then. Yeah, what's going on with that bitch, man? <laughs> that bitch is superhero, baby. Oh, man. Damn, man. He Tell us dude. the world's going to end now. Is Mr. Cleo crazy talk, is man. Eduardo Tiempo storyline? Mr. Cleo's it's not part crazy of talk. Stud- I mean, I guess he could. I feel like he's in the same universe. He's actively trying to balance these scales of Victor versus Eduardo, right? So Eduardo's trying to stop Victor from killing him, and Victor's trying to stop Eduardo from meeting Crystal Quartz. But guess who runs the Izakaya? Mr. Cleo. (laughs) He runs an Izakaya. Damn. He's retired from fortune telling because he's tired of seeing the future. He's well, tired. He's not, of reti- seeing- he's not oh, retired, shit, dude. He's tired of seeing the future, so he gouged his eyes out. Oh, so now man, he's stuck that's too in dark. His- <laughs> no, why? Does he wear blind man glasses? <laughs> yeah. Wow. But you can still see because he's so like season. you know yeah. in tune yeah. with, he sees shit. with his mind. He can only yeah, see the man. current time Echo because his eyes. I'ma steal something. <laughs> one eye can see the future. The other one can see the other <laughs> can see twisted, the past. Man. The Come other, on, the, man. One eye can see the future. The other can see the past. One is a memory, and the other's a dream. <laughs> what? That's the past in the future. Why a not? dream's not a future. It can be. A dream can be a future, dog. <laughs> Burrito, we need Please. you to fucking adjudicate here. Yeah, I, I, I guess the dream could be like a oh, premonition. Fuck. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah it's true. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, so, me. memory oh, and that? dream. It's true. I'll allow memory it. and dream, but he exists. <laughs> he exists across all timelines, so he can see memories and dreams from all timelines. This character's going deep. Yeah, that's Mr. Cleo. Oh, that's Mr. Cleo. I thought we were still talking about Vector. No, Vector, no. We're done with Vector. We're done with Vector. That guy's soggy dick. We're talking about Usually Mr. the villains Cleo, don't man. have a great backstory. Yeah, fuck like it. He just wants his girl back, but he Mr. fucked Cleo, up. Mr. Cleo, that is the glue that holds this universe exactly, together. Exactly, because he's across all timelines, right? Yeah. That's why he has to stay low-key. That's why he, in this specific timeline, he's running an Izakaya. Is, you only really is, see his is eyes once. Izakaya... Yeah, accessible through all timelines. It's like the point where the time all the timeline meets. Yes, yes, the time Izakaya. But it's all it's always like uh, just a. Di- I mean, I guess wherever the place and time. I could see the super cool congregate. graphic right now where you have all these like vertical lines or yeah, yeah where it's just like together. he's doing the exact same thing across all those timelines. But there's like a very there's a slice of each timeline. A uh, horizontal lines. Yeah. And then they curve down together, and in the middle is like the Izakaya. That make a dope poster. Yeah. Kind oh, of semi's looking, and there's like multiple lines, yeah. and then like they eventually come into a point in the middle yeah. by curving. I yeah. think that curving cool. on each other. There you go. They're I don't know what an Izakaya would look like illustrated though. It just seems like you would just make a storefront looking thing. I mean, is there doors and windows on this? <laughs> there's a door. Kind it's of a sliding door. Here? It's a sliding door. And paper walls. No, it's a building, man. <laughs> they have paper walls. <laughs> yeah, they do got paper walls, man. On the inside. Not, on the inside. <laughs> on the inside. Yo, man, they got paper walls, man. No. Yeah, but they also got real walls. They, but yeah, real walls yeah, too. Wood walls too. Yeah. We compromise. So, Mr. Cleo, this was my shot. So he's doing the. Oh, exact this same is your motion. superhero. Yeah. All right. But he's doing the exact same. I was thinking of a video, like a visual, that he's doing the exact same thing in this Izakaya. Across all timelines. Is this kind of like, like the opening of Doro He Doro? I didn't see Where she's see making it. the... Uh, no, oh. no. Just just listen to me. It is, right? No. Box shot. <laughs> For every... Oh, wait, I just listen to me. So, just listen, so, just so, listen, so just 10 listen. pixels across, right? All the way across. Like a Nintendo game? 10 pixels. So it's 10 pixels by 1080 pixels, right? And you stack that so that it's 1900 by 10 pixels. And you stack that to where it's a full frame of 1900 by 1080, right? Okay. And but I thought each, it was 1920. 1920 by 1080. All right. But each slice is from a different timeline. But he himself is doing the exact same thing. So all those lines converge into the middle? No. So he looks like a coherent image, right? Oh, I got you. But like he's wearing different clothes. He might have different facial hair, but he's just doing his thing across all time. Is this like Blink-182's Always video? I didn't watch that shit. Man. 
Anybody watch that shit? I did. I, I don't remember it. Yeah, no, nobody no. saw it. <laughs> nobody saw it. Sit your little sexy ass down. So Mr. Cleo, he's just... His involvement with the Edward Tiempo story is he's just... He's trying to maintain balance. Right. Like, he sees and time... Like everywhere. Efficiently. Yeah. So he's just kind of like dropping fortune cookie tips at the izakaya because he can't leave the izakaya. The izakaya is like the center Ever? point. No, this, the izakaya is the center it's point of the universe. It's happening all the time. It's like they're in every moment of every second. They're in his every, ass then, huh? Shit. Inside of his ass. They're inside <laughs> of Mr. Cleo's ass. What's the circle game? What's the circle game? <laughs> what is the Do circle game? Do you guys remember game? the circle game? I thought it was called Cheerio. Cheerio. Yeah, yeah. I don't we even. Call know. It oh, that game where you punch people. Yeah, 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 mm. yeah. They so call it they cereal game it because they're trying to take away the, the brand recognition. Circle. They call it circle game because they're trying to take away brand recognition. Pizza game. Pizza game. Pizza game. Pizza game. That's what we're going to start calling it now. Because it's pizza a circle. Game. We just renamed circle. renamed the circle game the pizza yeah, game, and it's going to. Is catch there any fire. rule changes? It's going to. Yeah, you slug them and they owe you a pizza. Damn. Ooh. That's an expensive game. Five ninety yeah. nine. I mean, that's as cheap as it gets. But don't look at the circle, then, dude. Maybe <laughs> play either. the pizza game on someone like oh, don't I'll play get you, it on like, a the hobo. Best pizza ever. No, no. What? Like if it was like a buddy who was loaded. Oh, you're you're so like, you're saying you gotta check out this pizza. You're saying you're gonna go like this to Warren Buffett. Y'all owe me a pizza, bitches. Yeah, like that. Ah! <laughs> 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 I played the pizza game virtually, baby. So you lost the pizza game, Gemini Jackson. I didn't. Well, let's just say you did once. Oh, hypothetically? Hypothetically. I can't because I can see across all timelines, baby. You no, can't. that's Mr. Cleo. <laughs> you can't talk about Gemini Jackson. Miss me with that. Okay, what are you talking about then? And you lose it. And yeah. Oh, what pizza you am I get, buying? Yeah. Totino's, baby. Fuck you. No, I'm man. Res- I'm hateful. All right. Cook it yourself. You're a bitch. <laughs> Cook it yourself, bitch. You want a Lunchable? Dude, You've got, got a Lunchable. Cooked. That's how you get that's a like Lunchable. That's straight out the hey, freezer section. Hey, Lunchable already ready to eat, man. You just got to sample it. I want a little twist of not. I don't even want this. I want to give you something you don't want. It's an individual Red Baron, half the box, just one of the pies. Yeah, I want to give you something you don't want because you hit me with that circle. How about you, Foxtrot? You lost the pizza game, and now you owe them a pizza. What pizza would oh, you get this person? It depends who it was. If I, it's if a friend. I like you, if the you burrito, like it. It was like the one burrito, of you guys, the burrito, the burrito. It's the burrito. The burrito. You gotta get him a pizza. The burrito. I'll get him Totino's. <laughs> oh! <laughs> no, I'll get you at least a DiGiorno. Or get him at least a, a Red Baron. Straight up. At least yeah, I'd get Baron. it delivered to his house because Ooh, that's yeah. just the simplest. Red Baron is good. Yeah. but The personal like, one? The thin crust. Yeah. yeah well, Whatever one, one he wants, standard. man. Oh, you like the personal one? Cool. Or I don't know. The yeah, personal it's been a while since they got one. Comes the, 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 the bread ones are pretty good. <laughs> the French bread? <laughs> yeah. Damn, those, those are pretty, sad. Ooh. Man, I was like, just that's because you don't have a Balmuda. <laughs> that French bread shit's fucking gourmet in Balmuda. You got to send a picture of that. Of me making uh, French bread pizza. Dude, that's yeah, so easy, yeah. man. Oh, that should be what your yeah. channel's all easy. about. Is it's just 24 7 Balmuda yeah. channel. No, everything. It's like you Balmuda do 100 channel. videos of cooking something in the Balmuda. That's fucking funny. And then just upload them all. Dude, I should, and, and the channel's name is There Is No Life Before Balmuda. Dude, this could be a food blog. No, it's just Balmuda blog. Because yeah. there is no life before Balmuda. Yeah. That's the Easy. handle. That's Easy. the handle. It's a long ass handle, and I bet I can secure the dot com. We'll talk about that later. There is no life before Balmuda. So the pizza game burrito, let's say Gemini pulled yeah. the, the Cheerio on you. Yeah. Fast one, baby. All right. Before yeah. we go too far, think about it. How would you describe the circle game to someone that's never played the circle game before? Touch your thumb to your index finger. Like an okay? Like an okay. Now hold it below your waist and yeah. then get someone to look at it. Made you look. Read a book. Now your pants are on a hook. And, and the old school pizza. way of playing is that if you, can you would put slug your them finger, in the arm. Right. Oh, but if that, the other yeah. person can disarm That's a cancel. it. If the other person can disarm it without How do you looking, disarm they got to use their periphery. They can't make eye contact with the hole. They can't make <laughs> eye contact with Sauron. <laughs> so they got to jab their finger in it. They got to lick their finger first. They got to put their whole. They have to put their whole, finger, put their whole to finger, their finger all the way down their throat. They got to nah, get the. Fa- they got to get the back What's throat next, butter. Man? Because <laughs> only the back throat, throat butter. Playing. Bro, what the fuck? I That's play like for keeps. Six point nine. I play for keeps. <laughs> Holy shit! You got to get game, the back like throat butter, no more, man. This game's kind of getting kind of. <laughs> crazy. You got to scrape it with your fingernail because that's the only thing that's going to disarm that damn Cheerio bomb from going off. Bullshit. 
That's where the COVID lives, man. Inside that Cheerio bomb, you're goddamn right. And the only this way should you be a restricted game, game then, I guess. Huh? You gotta stick your finger in well, that I mean, Cheerio? Yeah. You gotta lance that bitch, but if you miss, <laughs> you hold you it hands. Lance it? Fuck you hold it hands with spit on your hand. What's the Shit. consequence? Of what, missing? There's no consequence. The other person will just go... Like this, and they like they never tried to start nothing in the first place. <laughs> oh, and everyone would fucking I, forget about it, right? Everyone nah, would just magically nah, forget. No one would forget. Nah, about I play it. for keeps. No one's gonna. This forget wet about ass it. finger from the back of my throat butter's got to go somewhere. You need to sit your little sexy Shit, ass. You gotta be the champion. So, what kind of pizza is a burrito? CPK. Um, <laughs> maybe if I have a free one on my Domino's, oh! <laughs> it's only Man. your ass only worth. What, what if you don't points. have a? What if you don't have a free one? You then he's gonna buy it. himself three pizzas <laughs> yeah. to get the three credits back, right. so that he can send your ass the fucking Damn. free one. <laughs> That's fucking funny. You'll just get it to Tino's CPK. <laughs> I probably do the Red Baron as well. CPK at least Red Baron. Man, What's for CPK, everybody. Gemini Jackson? Oh, I never had TPK, man. Ca- uh, California frozen pizza. pizza kitchen. It's good. It's all right. It's overrated. Is that- overrated. Shit. Fucking guess what? I tried. Bread. I tried something, man. I tried oh. the cauliflower H E B pizza one. Oh, Ooh. here's a review. And, and that shit was bomb. Damn, you heard it here but first. It was, Damn, it was but- tiny. It was tiny, man. Yeah, because cali- the cauliflower stuff's expensive. But, dude, it was so crispy. Ooh. I was like, dude, what the fuck Ooh. am I eating here, man? Like, pizza crackers? Ooh. I don't am know. Am I what, eating pizza like. cocaine? But you then the I looked at it. Yourself? I was like, man, is this going to be just this as good like for me? Big. And I was like, man, this is the same as pizza. It just it just tastes good. There's one that I like. I, I don't remember the brand, but it's got, like, corn. Made out of Fritos? Uh, oh. No, no, no. It's a, it's a real pizza, but this is just, like, the toppings. It, they're all veggies. Like, God. Oh, okay. But, it's not like corn and... Why does um, the corn stick out to you the most? Because he like corn uh, and it's an unusual thing to put <clears throat> on pizza. Yeah. You know, it's not a normal topping, but also uh, Brussels sprouts. Uh, oh, which is you didn't lead with good. that? You didn't lead with that? Fries, Interesting. I guess that's like... Wait, that's a frozen a, pizza? Wow, that's, that's a crazy a thing pizza? to put yeah, on a pizza. pizza. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I'll Brussels sprouts. Like that. I wouldn't mind trying corn. it. I think this was the Central Market fancy oh, pizza. Oh, Central Market. Jesus yeah. Christ. Does it have cherry tomatoes on it too? And artichoke hearts. I go make you a pussy uh, stink. I don't think so. I don't no. like artichoke hearts. I get it at the, H- at the H-E-B plus. Oh, you don't like artichoke hearts? Besides uh, um, spinach artichoke tip. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I like those. Those are good. Artichoke hearts? Yeah. Would you how say about broken they're, hearts? Would you say they're good or they're just like bland? <laughs> hey, man. How about, how about broken you hearts? Flavor. You didn't answer. Broken hearts yeah. have a flavor? What is the flavor of broken Bro- hearts, man? <laughs> Broke it, salty tears. Wow, <laughs> damn. Salted Does it tears. have a certain smell too? Is it? Yeah. Just what's the tears? smell of fucking yeah, broken hearts? Smell? But dissy. Uh, yeah. It smell like but dissy. No, you know what? You know what this smell of a broken heart is? Mm. A butterfly's wing. A butterfly's wing. How? How beautiful. Yeah. What does that smell like? You gotta deep, smell it. Like <laughs> butt dick and pussy, deep, man. What do you think? Yeah, but this he dude. <laughs> <laughs> a butterfly wing. You, see, the thing is, nobody knows what they smell like, but everybody knows what they smell like because everybody had heartache, man. Butterfly wing. Shit. There's a motherfucking butterfly <laughs> scientist out there that's like, <laughs> he's lying to everybody. This Mr. Cleo from the future is lying to everybody. You're but, an asshole. Does it Broken smell like expired smell like milk? milk? Does it smell like expired milk? If that's what you want it to smell know, like, man, it can smell like that. Smell like, dude. <laughs> it's a good transition, yeah. burrito. Yeah. Are we over the pizza game? Yeah. Well, what else was there after the pizza game? Milk we, expiration dates. Oh. Yeah. Those are just like guidelines. Hey, man. I just look at it, man. If it ain't I, cheese, then drink it. with ease. Yeah, dude. <laughs> that's, exactly. that's the old yeah. adage, right? Say it, Gemini Jackson. That say it. is the adage. If say it ain't it one cheese, more time. you drink it with ease. Thank you. That yeah. is the end of that. God damn. If it ain't really cheese, good. you may really proceed. Good. Do you give it a little smell or like nah. shake it around? You dick or something? in, you put it all the way in your cereal and like, fuck, it's expired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck, I fucked this up. That's the worst, Time man. That's the worst, man. Cheesy Cheerios. Because that's like the last of your cereal, too. And you have no milk. So you're like, dry cereal. I can never smell it. Yeah. Because you but got so, cook a COVID. So I, if it's getting like to that point, I mean, I don't really drink milk anymore, but when I do have milk, I also and it, drink Dosaki meal. Like I have to, I have to actually take a little sip of it to see if it's to still see? good. Damn! Yeah. So you got to dick in a little bit. You yeah. Gotta put just the, like the. And the, you have a spit take. 
So do you just like stick your tongue in there like a bat? <laughs> uh, no, or do I you usually sip pour it. Like, like I pour it? like a little tiny. You bit. actually pour it in a glass. You live alone. In a thimble. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, man. Just take it. <laughs> what? I mean, if it's bad, you're going to throw it out anyways. Yeah. Why dirty a dish? Why dirty a dish? I just smell it. He can't but, like, smell it. He can't smell it. You can't smell it. You missed that part. He, he said it at the top it. of the hour. If you were going to taste it, how would you taste it, Foxtrot? Spoiled milk. I would just fucking... I would just... Put in your cereal and be like, oh, yeah. He would, he would do your finger it. Yeah. He would use his Coke nail to get a little He would get his Coke nail. A That's little cheese for. drop. A little cheese That's drop. Right up, there for. right up the dome. Mm-hmm. Straight to the rub dome. It on like, the gums. Oh. Yeah, he would rub the fucking milk on his gums. <laughs> this shit expired. Whoa, this shit is bad. This ain't even Ooh, that shit. Exactly was expired. Oh, this ain't even that shit. He would get his keys out. <laughs> stick it in the milk. He got his bump key. Or his little spoon for his, his ears. Spoon. Or his fucking, his vacuum from fucking wish.com. What? <laughs> Dude, you've never seen these? What is this? They're like a vacuum, vacuum from wish.com. They're nose vacuums. What? They look like I've a nose. never seen this. No, they look like a vacuum. I know, but I've never seen a nose vacuum. This but makes you go know straight what? to the dome Damn, or something? Damn, dog. Wish.com. Do you, do you, what, you know what, what I'm talking about? Over there, man? Do you know what I'm what talking about? No, I don't. Okay, no. I'll, find a, I'll find a picture. Somebody carry the conversation, please. I was talking about Yerba Mate mm-hmm. and how Foxtrot hasn't had energy drinks in a while because he's been doing this stuff called Yerba Mate. Oh, yeah, man. It's so you good, got man. a kilo of this stuff, right? Is yeah. it just like loose leaves or what is this? Is it powder? It's, yeah, it's like they grind everything. It's like a different type from a different like part of South America that they drink this stuff from. So there's different kinds. But uh, what's your version like? This is the one I like. It's very earthy. That's but do you have I to like. brew it like coffee or like steep it Dude, like tea? It, it's like tea. Yeah, it's like tea. You, so you put you it in a like bag tea. and you soak it in water? No, I mean, they have like a traditional way to drink it, but I don't have this like cup thing and the straw thing. So I, I have to like boil water and I make sure it's at the right temp and I steep it. But I also have to strain it like a lot because um, it's like dust and really fine. It's like really fucking fine. So you're fine. always going to have fines at the bottom. Yeah, but I, I get it to where it's pretty gold and it's just really good. Is it like matcha? Like I guess you could texture? almost compare it to matcha, but not as strong as matcha. Mm. But it gives so you, you a lot, um, a nice boost of caffeine. Oh, that's a vacuum, dude. It looks like. What is that, man? But it what is it nose? small? Is it what is this lithium ion? What is it? It's a vacuum that fits up your nostril. Man, <laughs> that seems dangerous. <laughs> it's for yeah, cocaine. It? Imagine how much nose blood like falls on those things on the rig. Oh, it's for cocaine. Yeah, it's, it's like a joke thing. <laughs> You're what vacuuming it, it all here? up, dude. <laughs> like I see now. I see. Yeah. Now. I see now. Sorry. I thought that would hit. I thought, it was I thought it. that would have hit it way harder. Nah, man. It, yeah, I mean, it does me. now. It hits so hard. Yeah, but I missed now. it. I missed that. I thought you were window. vacuuming stuff oh, out of your nose. Oh, that seems dangerous. Like the little baby. That's ball. what I thought too. Yeah. It was a vacuum. <laughs> Damn, yeah, that seems dangerous. Sexy ass down. So you haven't been drinking any energy drinks because the yerba mate has been doing it. Uh, well, I seem to like to like take breaks throughout the year for different types of caffeine I drink anyway. Like he I'll drink his coffee for a good while. So how do you and get then those I'll switch extra it for the energy out. drinks? How do you get the extra fines out? Oh, I have uh, that other way to make coffee where you pour it. French, French press? press? Yeah. No, 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 the other no. one. You it's just like pour there's it a funnel on, on the top oh, and you right. just pour the hot water Yeah, on that it. shit's yeah. like really That's fine. True. So I pour it down there and it gets it to where it's gold and it's like really nice to drink. Do you yeah. add anything like honey? What's it taste yeah, like? Yeah, I do honey. I got Manuka honey, so it's extra special. <laughs> Tell me about Manuka Ooh. honey. You got Melaleuca honey? It's got like medicinal purposes and what shit. You got everybody. fucking Melaleuca honey? Where does this come from? Man, it comes from New Zealand, man. Damn. Wow. Yeah, is it but you know what's because so of I New Zealand I can't, I can't use this and one. And eucalyptus? Well, I can't use this one because I got it from when she was sick. Uh-huh. So it's like still, con- I guess, contaminated. So I guess I shouldn't use it. Right? <laughs> I don't know. Are yeah. you talking about honey? Honey would doesn't grow bacteria, man. Nose? Yeah, honey. Can, yeah, what'd she do? Did she spit in it? She likes to just eat it and stuff. Oh, no, it's fine, man. I'll stick the she spoon back fine, in right? there. Yeah, yeah. You're fine, man. Honey's like, honey I mean, it, it doesn't matter. No, honey doesn't, doesn't grow matter, bacteria. When, honey doesn't grow yeah. bacteria. It's all sugars. That's why it, it doesn't has matter. But yeah, it's really good. But that's why you can eat caffeine. You can eat honey. Honey never goes bad. You can eat prehistoric honey. Real honey. Yeah, real honey never goes bad. No, no, I'm not worried that it's bad. It's just that she was sick and just like handling all that oh, shit with yeah, all the yeah. sick stuff. 
You could sanitize it. But I don't think we eating have. it with your tummy. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter, but it's good. <laughs> this shit's good. So does yeah, the job? I like to change my caffeines throughout the year because it gets boring. He switch hits. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's number five for the year. The water is the constant. Water is the constant. So is there anything special you do with the water other than boil it to the perfect temperature? What's the perfect temperature? 180 uh, Celsius? Around 170. Damn, but... Yeah, so you don't fucking Celsius. over... I don't fucking know, man. Just 170. Whatever the thing tells me, you know? Yeah. Tell me about the water. Is it alkaline? I don't know, man. It's, it's from my place. fucking fridge, man. It's Just perfect. out of the fridge dispenser? Fuck yeah. That's How often do you change that filter? Every when it months, goes man. red. There you when go. When it goes red. I already got this backups, man. No, nah, not the, the ones on man. Amazon. So let's talk nah, about dude, teeth. I don't even buy shit from Amazon that much anymore. Where's your go-to? Hey, good for you, man. I don't know. I just changed. I just, he likes to change I don't know, wherever. Hey, Walmart. I don't know. It's the fifth one for this. Just change there, year. man. It don't matter. So we mentioned teeth earlier for some reason. Burrito brought it up. He said, Did floss, I? brush, mouthwash. Oh, no, because no, I was okay. changing the energy drinks. Yeah, because I was changing teeth. my. That's yeah. why you. Like it'll help my teeth too, to like kind of recharge. <laughs> Is that bad? No, but I mean, dude, acid baby. Do you use uh, an electric toothbrush though? Yeah, I have one. Tell me about it. It's cool, man. It massages my gums and shit. It fucking feels phenomenal. Is it Philips or Oral B? Dude, both. Wish <laughs> <Shit>, man. <laughs> Give me the Oral B. That's, that's Mondays are Philips. There's a Shit. new one coming out that... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is it the it, Cardi B yeah. one? Bluetooth. No, no, no. Yeah, it connects it to your phone. Your mouth. Why? Oh, yeah, tell you. Your How did you know that? Yes. <laughs> Have you seen it? <laughs> really? oh, what? <laughs> wait, what do you mean? Wait, wait, wait. What did it, what did it do? What did it do? It, it tracks it, your it brushing like, like your steps. How long you've been in a certain oh, area I, of your oh, mouth. Oh, oh, I was under the yeah. impression it took GPS tracking on it? In your mouth. That's crazy. So you're like supposed to brush 100% of your teeth and you got an app that shows you what you're missing. Yeah. Wow. That's involved. So they've got an upgrade coming. Oh, shit. So you got, you got one? Does it, that, does it brush no. your butt too? No, no, no. It's got Pass. a little light on it. It's got a little light on it that so like will... Well, it'll like... It will... Camera? I guess like the plaque on your teeth will fluoresce under a certain type of light or something. Black light? And so UV light? it can... The toothbrush actually like detects the plaque and, and will like light up when you have some, and so you just brush until the little light turns off in a certain area or something like that. I don't know. Oh. I gotta watch the video again. It sounds kind of cool. When's it gonna brush my teeth for me? That'd be nice. <laughs> gonna give like a Roomba <laughs> and give blowjobs. <laughs> it could be like that. I, room actually, that, hey, no, guys, like I can brush my own fucking teeth. <laughs> <laughs> You need to sit your little sexy ass down. <laughs> hey, I'll be here all week. <laughs> He's right, though. It's all about your own technique, your habits. Don't sweat the technique. Yeah, I mean, you've been doing it for how long, preserving them? Yeah, it doesn't matter which hand you use. And you, floss? <laughs> you gotta switch it, man. In life. Do you use any kind of special floss? Waxed. Yeah, man, I just use this fucking oral B. He's got some handy. Floss. We've got talked about satin this. Floss. Dude, no, we've I talked have about this. Me he has a wi- always time. within arm's reach and dude, always, always in it. the bug out bag. Dude, I have this fucking dentist that fucked my teeth up in the back, man. It's fucking annoying as shit. Wow. It's yeah. just like this gap. Like, I have to constantly That's what happens clean. when you go to dentist in fucking Asia, man. Why don't you get it fixed? <laughs> I didn't go to Asia. <laughs> it was just down the fucking road years ago. <laughs> you can get it fixed, though. You balling. Yeah, hey. You got dude. that insurance. No, you don't need Dude, insurance. I, Go overseas have, and get your I teeth have fixed. Insurance, but it's still expensive, man. Go overseas and it's expensive get your teeth to fix fixed. it. Plus, insurance will only I, cover no, like a no. thousand bucks. I don't no, need a new. I got a crown last year. He's got to do face. like he's got to do like teeth moving. Yeah, like braces. Probably. I don't want to do that. I'll just get fucking. How about some Invisaligns, man? No, they have to drill into his jaw. What? Yeah, I don't want. No, I don't want that. Is that really? Mandibular action. Dude, that's fuck that you, man. Really? No, that's because it's just fucked up, man. <laughs> mandibular Isn't that action. That fucked up my mandibular mandibular action, dude. No, look I know, but shit. like, look, the it's reason you perfect. got shit stuck in your teeth all the time is because oh, you got shit. mandibular inaction. Oh, no, dude, I just eat meat. What dog. you fucking need fuck is mandibular you, man. action. You eat dick. You just swallow it. Oh, that's why you eat nothing gets you in your teeth, man. Exactly, because the dick can't get in my teeth because I got mandibular <laughs> yeah, action. Yeah, because man. it's down your throat, man. No, it man. passed the teeth. That doesn't even make sense. It's, it's it attached make to a sense, human man. body. No, and dude. And balls and stuff. Yes, Turns out dude, it's a 27 inch tail. It's dude, a 27 inch know. tail. Yo. <laughs> I just don't know. 
It's got to touch the teeth. It's got to touch the teeth. Mouthwash. Basically. Mouthwash. It's touch <laughs> yeah, dude, of course. <laughs> you got to. You got to, man. It's got to touch the teeth. The reason you get shit stuck in your teeth is because you got mandibular inaction, man. Dude, I got mouthwash, dog. And floss. floss. You wouldn't need that bullshit if you had Yo, mandibular dude, action, you man. No. You could use those toothpick thingies with the no. little sharpen Mm-mm. to get in there. Like nope. fucking. What do you do when something gets stuck, though? I can't I use it. with it. <laughs> <laughs> you live with it? No, man. Man, I got like gaps stuff. in my teeth. I never have like fucking shit caught in there. Or I'll just go. <laughs> <laughs> Forever, God damn it! Until it comes out, and then you get like a headache, and your like neck hurts because like <laughs> your neck hurts because you've been controlling your tongue for so long. You know what I mean? Yeah, that you've been doing good, the alphabet. Dude. You could just get some fucking floss. Nah, mint essential. Men, he gets it out with his a uh, UV detection. Yeah, toothbrush. <laughs> Don't do I that motion, it. man. You were like, you <laughs> yeah, with the- <laughs> I should have been recording that shit. Yeah, you should have recorded that. That was fucking gold. Always stream, he said. Always be dude, streaming with a UV toothbrush. Some, some pretty good stream stuff last week. Thanks, what? man. Thanks. Yeah, well, that's a different story. But I got some cool clips of uh, oh, the fuck. god shit. The gods, man. Fox shot was a god, man. He dicked in and fucking killed a motherfucker. We got lucky. Describe man. it to the that listeners. Was, that was fun. That was fun. So it was bottom of the ninth. The 69th. Base is loaded. Bottom of the 69th. Everybody's dead but Foxtrot. Two, and they've already planted the bomb. So Spike. Foxtrot not only has to This is Valorant, right? Yeah. He's gotta he's gotta make a quick decision. Do I kill these motherfuckers and disarm the bomb? Or do I just go to Psalm the Bomb? Actually, no, we were on attack. So we, we planted the bomb. We planted the bomb. He's got to protect the bomb from these <laughs> bastards. <laughs> so do you understand r- this game, Burrito? No. All right, there's it's two okay. sides. It's a little bit oh. like Capture the Flag. There's two uh-huh. sides. One has to plant the spike in the enemy base, and the enemy has to disarm the spike. and Or kill- eliminate Or the eliminate everybody. Team. And No, no, they have to disarm the spike regardless. Oh, you're right. So... The way the people who are attacking can win is they can kill all the bad guys or they can let the bomb go off, right? So that's the objective. That's how you score. That's how you score. So we were planting the bomb and all of us were dead except for Foxtrot. They had two guys who were trying to disarm our bomb. So Foxtrot runs in, doesn't even like make any quiet motions. He's just kills a guy. What kind of gun was he using? He was using the Uzi. The Uzi. The Spectre. So he goes upstairs and I'm like... Dude, I think he's he's downstairs, right underneath you. It's called hell. So I said, I think he's in hell. He's in hell. And he flashes in. Nothing. He's all the way in heaven. I'm like, dude, don't jump because you're going to get hurt. So he jumps. Usually that's what happens, yeah. So I got lucky. He, no, because from that fall, you, you get fall damage. Yeah, that's so right. So he jumped off and got fall damage. And the guy was sitting there already. And he's like, ah, rat. <laughs> yeah, I got lucky. Blat, blat, blat. Like, blat. it scared me, too. Yeah. It scared me too, but it scared him but too. But that was a motherfucking pro gamer move. He never Dude. fucking thought you'd rain that shit on him. I never do that shit. That he was cool. He never thought you would rain hell on him. Dude, I watched and it then like they forfeited. times. Yeah, I bet you were like stroking it for the fifth. Oh, bitch. Just watching Dude. your own clip. Dude, <laughs> this I, was motherfucker, like laughing. I was just this laughing. This motherfucker watched all the internet porn. He's like, I need something new. So now he just watches his own <laughs> Valorant best of clips. That's how he gets hey, to number man. five. That's how you get it's to number best, five. Dude. Dude. That's how I get to number five every day. Are now. You, That's um, cool, man. Are you trying to, to plant the bomb at the same time the other team is trying to plant the now, bomb? Only, or one no, side, only one side has only the one side turn to plant this bomb. And the other side is the defenders. You two and sometimes three places that you can plant the bomb. Bomb, a, B, or C, uh, right? So there's different arenas each round. Yeah. There's like four to revolve around. Yeah. But hmm. each zone has its own places to yeah. plant if the spike. If you're attacking, your objective is to plant the spike and, and let it go off. And once the spike's planted, there's a good, what, minute or 30 seconds, 30 45 seconds. seconds? For it before it explodes. Yeah. So they have So the time opposing to come team can go disarm this bomb or knock everyone out, then go disarm the bomb. But regardless, they have to disarm the bomb if it's been planted. But they can also score if they knock out everybody before the plan, before the planted. spike gets planted. Their objective mm. is uh, to okay. ensure the bomb does does not go off. Your objective is to ensure that the bomb does go off. Yeah. And it's and like an, assum- bag it's, the shit it's out an of assumption them. that if you kill <laughs> all of them, dominate. you can let your bomb go off. And so. before each round, you equip yourself with arsenal and armor. Right. And that's how you defend yourself. Right. And you also have these super power-ups. They got my is. special. 
There it is. Well, not only just your special, but like your, your utility stuff. Foxtrot's character can like throw a fireball and then the enemy team is like blinded for a second. Or I can blind myself because I don't really know how to use always it. Blind which himself. usually happens and a lot. his entire team who's just... And, yeah, and it fucks everyone <laughs> else up. So it's not just, you know, not just me. So the, this play is actually like not a great play to do, but he ex executed it flawlessly and secured the lucky, win. Man. And secured the win. <laughs> yeah, it was great. He brought Dude, it I'm, home. I'm fucking ready to play tomorrow. Fuck yeah, man. God's tomorrow. Yeah. Let's get it. So in essence, Foxtrot pulled a power move that mm -hmm. just looks so a badass on the stream. Move. He three, 360 no scoped a guy on three on a kind of yeah. You did you kind of. It was at least a 180, and it was definitely no scope. Dude, but dude, once I found the mouse, yeah, I definitely right. played a lot better. It's like it's it's science. Like it, yeah, like it was crazy. Guys, actually, like as good as I've been playing, I I realized I've been playing wrong. What do you How mean? did you correct yourself, Gemini Jackson? My natural tendency, or what I'm really good at, is flick aiming. Oh, flick you aiming? like to flick. I'm flick aiming. But I, I like haven't been. I haven't like been. To flick. I haven't been. I've been trying to track. But is this I, like I, wanted? How do you describe flick no, aiming? No, he likes to do so this. So flick aiming is you just constantly rely on your reflexes. So you kind of like look at a, a center point and then when the bad guy pops up, you don't even take your eyes off that center point. You just flick your wrist and your gun goes directly to that person and you pop them. How should so you you're gonna playing? you're gonna play at no, like that's your input with your you're gonna play that's, it like that's at, how that I sensitivity. that's how I yeah no that's that's how I should be playing and that's how I've been playing like the last couple rounds and I've been fucking stomping it. I've been playing with a lower yeah yeah no I've been like killing it on a, on comp so like this oh, is how I'm gonna oh. play now like before it'd be cool. like I'd be just tracking and then like I would try to stay like my eyes I would try to keep my eyes on like yeah. where the target is. So I would look to the target, follow it with my mouse cursor, and try to pop him. But Whereas you're this way, this way, I just do this. It's like yeah. this. It's like an instant flick. So you're looking cool. out of the corner of your eye. Yeah, you use your peripheral version. You just keep your eyes here, and you just flick and you flick and click. So you just make sure that yeah. you have that exact motion, and then you click at the exact time you need to click. Yeah, a lot, a lot of, of times you go there. past the person, but like because you know you need to do this motion, but you click like early. You go click. Before you actually hit. So it's yeah. just like, click. Yeah. It's called slicing through the Quantimino. It's called slicing Shit. through the Quantimino. And that's a cool man. gamer move. Yeah. Gemini Jackson is definitely a... Uh, I'm um, stoked about that, On man. the leaderboards. I'm stoked on, the on God's that. Night. Yeah, because I was like, good. when I realized, I was like, yeah, what the fuck? I'm hitting everything. Because I was just like kind of fucking around and just like, all right, well, I'm just going to go like, see if I can hit these bad guys, right? On the yeah. practice range. And I'm just like, ting, 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 head, miss, head, 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 Hi. Oh, yeah. That's cool, man. That's good. That's good news. Let's get some green tomorrow. That's good news. Shit. Let's get some green. Speaking of green, what we got next? Oluteas Financial Advisors. When you got to move some weight, why wait? Julio will help you diversify your holdings. Flat rate, always great. Julio gets it done. Call Julio Tejas today. Or regret it tomorrow. Julio Tejas. This is the news. An Indonesian man becomes a millionaire as meteorite crashes into home. Did he immediately buy a PS5? Dang, dude. Yeah, what about those PS5s, man? That's a kind of like a sideline story, and you know, yeah, and all That's this hot madness. Topic. That's the hot topic in all this madness. PS5, PS5 and GTX 3080s. Oh, the GTX 3080s? GTX 3080s, that's what all the fucking that's nerds the are after. Shit. Fuck, man. That's that Burrito, are you going to get one of those? That's Jesus what you need, Christ. man. It's a gaming card. You need. Uh -huh. You don't want it. You need it. And when you need things... You need things. That, that's a responsibility. Mm -hmm. See? There you go. <laughs> Dang, so uh, a millionaire, huh? For some fucking oh, meteorite. The meteorite had some Ooh, rare yeah. elements in it. So. Like what? Shut up. Minerals. Uranium. Triple uranium. Uh, triple uh, uranium. Fucking triple uranium. Meteoritium. Okay. Quantuminium. <laughs> it had <laughs> quantuminium. Yeah. Damn, but well, well, when you when you think about it, we're all made of quantuminium. We yeah. are, right? Yeah. Did it have space beef? Jesus, dude, it's gotta. It had a yeah. lot of beef. <laughs> it's gotta have space <laughs> beef. 
<laughs> Not as much as this Burger King uh, uh, hamburger here. Uh, Burger King Japan asks, can a sandwich have too much meat? Uh, the extreme super one pound beef burger delivers over a pound of bun free food. Isn't that just like a regular American burger? No, nah, the buns are the meat. Yeah, the two two patties. I like, the, I, I like the, the, I There's like a bread ad, in the though. middle. There's the a bread. There's really no cool. bread. No, There's no so bread. Just, meat. Meat. Beef, just two patties the on the top and on the bottom. Yeah, it's just with a naked burger. Lettuce. Yeah, tomatoes and onions. Huh. Mm. With like four pickles patties. in the middle. It's extreme. The lo- it looks cool. It's just four Whopper patties, and they put it in a box. Yeah, I like man. to make that myself though. Whopper I mean, order patties? It? You no. can't make Whopper patties yourself. No, not make them. Like, order it that way. You can't make Whopper patties yourself. That's a fucking patented secret recipe. The flame broiled is built in. That's the secret. The flame broiled is oh, built in. Oh, shit. Yep. It's already pre flame broiled from the factory, it's, baby. It's flame broiled from within. From within. Why? It's it's flame broiled from within. That would be so cool if it, if it was like that. That's like, the name of You just of got your, this package that's... and you just had to, like, crack it and it was just like. Flame broiled from within. Fucking. Extreme one pound beef burger would just show up with like fresh like uh, vegetables and shit and flame broiled on all sides, uh, insides, uh, outsides, uh, every side. That's upside, gonna take downsides. the Balmuda. Yeah, the Balmuda can do that. That's, and of that's, course, with that's, the that's mode two. Well, the Balmuda, that's thinking lightly. That's will the Balmuda mode two. make monkey brains bigger? Monkey brains bigger. Uh oh, scientists used human genes to make monkey brains bigger. I saw this story and I'm like, damn, but that's <laughs> hot shit. <laughs> It's I don't really shit. even know how to feel mm. about that. That's how you do it. That shit's gonna I happen. Like, the ape, man. Yeah, that shit's gonna happen, right? Yeah. That's smart. Are they? But, I mean, they like alcohol and shit. Just get them addicted just get them to drunk, shit. I guess. Easy. Yeah. Just get them addicted to the. They'll suck yeah. your dick for fucking for fucking cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> and monkeys got strong ass hands. Dude, monkeys are scary, dude. Yeah, they strong. Scary. As fuck, they might man. rip your dick off. Don't do it, dude. <laughs> dude. <laughs> Oh man! Just right off, scary, like, dude. and then walk away with it. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! As they're walking away, they're probably uh, <laughs> trying to get into this massive fourteen-hour line that formed in fucking Colorado for their first In-N-Out burger joint, which just seems man, that service crazy, sucks. mad, ridiculous. ridiculous. That service sucks. But yeah, like I it. love no, no. In-N-Out, the, but I would never wait answer, that long. Dude. No, never, no, ever, no. Why? Why? It's Why? just the line lasted for fourteen hours. Oh, it's I people see. were coming constantly, and they were going, and they were eating in and out. They're coming in and then going out with burgers. Damn, in and out though. I would love to own in and out. Fuck mm. man, the one in Slam Bi- City North. Yeah, Slam City North. That yeah. one's like never busy. That one's like busted. The what really? It's like cursed. Yeah. But how do you guys feel about these in and outs that aren't in the homelands? I don't care. Yeah, it's I'm just like it. another fast food. Yeah, joint. It's just I'm yeah, it's just whatever, man. I'm over it. But Colorado, man, they really thought In N Out was the shit. Or maybe they still do. I'm sure they still do. It's just but it's just the new it's, new. Probably they had nothing it's else. It's the first yeah, in that it's state. A, it's that know? novelty factor. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, In N Out is good. That sounds fucking delicious. I'm over it all the way. All right, man. I'm Damn, why are you hating, way. dog? Because I hate it. Are you over the teenage mutant ninja turtles? Yeah. That we need to shut this him. shit down. This guy hating too much. Leonardo leads Donatello does machines. <laughs> <laughs> Raphael is cool but rude. Give me a break. Michelangelo. Raph he's is a, a party, party dude. dude. Cowabunga. Teenage Mutant party. Ninja Turtles. So a huge sinkhole with glowing oh, yeah, green liquid appears on Toronto Street. Toronto? Toronto. Toronto? Yeah. Toronto? Toronto? There's a large sinkhole, you know, when the street just falls through. Toronto? Was well, that the hottest yeah. shit to hit the streets? For that time, being that should dude. be my rap name, Sinkhole. Sinkhole, that's a dumb name. Nah, man, this is a tearing the streets apart. <laughs> There's sinkhole. a growing green liquid inside that they determined oh, yeah. to be okay. thousands okay. of gallons okay. of antifreeze. Oh, okay. Now I made that part up. You mean ooze? That would be there horrible. It is. There that it would is. be horrible if that was just it's antifreeze. It's the ooze, and it's going into the sewers. We get How do you get Super Shredder? Name, mutant, mutant. Super Shredder? Fuck that guy. Super Shredder was freebasing ooze. ooze. <laughs> Fuck yeah, man. <laughs> And when he got caught up in that trash machine, he just became a really bad restoration. Yeah, something like oh, a yeah. restoration. Yeah, so you guys know all these botched restorations that have been happening. That's the, hot shit. The Jesus face. Of course, and Monkey the, Jesus. Uh, Monkey Jesus. Yeah, the, yeah. The, the cement um, sculpture. The sculpture recently, that was the most recent one. There was one. another there's, Jesus there's one. another one. Yeah. Tell yeah, us about it, Burrito. A Mary one. Yeah, well, there's a Japanese gotcha capsule toys 
that have um, that are of these botched art restorations. Yeah, you can buy them. Fun. Are these figurines and, yeah, of those? They're, yeah. they're like little keychains. Yeah, yeah. Of the art piece. Yeah. <laughs> I want Monkey Jesus Gotcha. I want Monkey Jesus Gotcha. Fun. Are these just quarter turn toys? Yeah. Is that what yeah. a Gotcha yeah. is? Yeah. 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 But That's like so they're funny. the big plastic balls. So what are some of the examples? <laughs> the ones you, you just called out, all? or there more? Yeah, this is yeah, yeah, for yeah. sure. Gemini yeah. would like this one. For I sure. want Monkey Jesus yeah. only, and then I want it big. I just want to buy Monkey Jesus. If I had, I, I can't remember. Is it is it like the the real one on one side and and the botched one on the other side, um, or is it all, both on the same I want side? It on I can't both remember. Sides. These are just keychains. No, no, it's just it's just the botched one. I want Monkey Jesus. Is it? Or maybe sides. it's a lenticular. Jesus, or maybe Christ. yeah, that'd be funny. Like they're just showing the botched. It's looking. a quantimeter. Oh no, I think you're right. I think on one side, yeah, it is. yeah it's yeah. it's it's one side was what it yeah, yeah. used to be, and the other side is what it yeah that's <laughs> what, what they fucked up. up. Yeah. And the other side turns out to be Guitar Center filing for bankruptcy. Guitar <laughs> Center filed for bankruptcy and good riddance. Now where are all these nerds gonna go play guitar for free? Yeah, where are they gonna go to test? Where are they shit gonna out? hang out and play guitar for free and never buy anything? Where are they gonna do that? And press all the keys on everything. Oh, man. Yeah. Where are they gonna do that? And ask for fucking guitar picks and shit, man. I don't know, man. I guess Guitar Center is uh, going all online. Is that what they're gonna do? No, they're going away. They bankrupt. forever. Like forever. who? Where oh, are they gonna get away, music away. shit, man? That's exactly what I've been trying to ask, but nobody was listening. I thought there's online oh. catalogs for that. Online Sears catalog? catalog? I hate to break it, baby. Sears, Sears is around, bankrupt. right? No, they're gone, right? But you gone. can't you can't go show off online. Uh oh. Why not? Because no one's there. You could do it on and, your and, OnlyFans. And your shit's not oh, free. Yeah. The whole point is that you don't have a guitar, but you go to these places. Right. Where you go to Guitar Center. But here's, to go the, play for free. here's the fucking rub of that all. You're just playing to other dudes. Mm. Time to suck today. Right. Yeah. And if a girl comes in, she already has a boyfriend who's trying to, who's like a scumbag and trying to buy a guitar, but he's like sneaking Johnny. 20s out of her purse. So there oh you go. shit! So there you go. This that's sounds like some real life life. That's real life, life stuff, dude. That's where Guitar Center fucked up. They should have filmed a drama based <laughs> as based around Guitar Center, and it's like all these dudes that come in to like try to play, like shred and shit. Like you right, They're trying, right, to, yeah, they're trying yeah. to impress chicks, but it's only dudes that come in. And then the one chick comes in. Guess what? She got a man who's a scumbag, and he's sneaking twenties out of her purse so that he can buy that Fender Stratocaster. Or maybe he just wants to buy a rare copy of Super Mario Three. Are you talking about the kit one, the or kit just one. the guitar? The kit no, one, right? The Japanese, <laughs> the Japanese Babingo one. I was thinking it was made of Babingo. Uh, I know you were. You, I know solid you, body. I, I saw it like the gear turn in your head. I'm like, all right, I better. <laughs> I guess I better say Babingo. <laughs> it's a requirement. Bermuda and Babingo. Got to appear in every episode going mm-hmm. forward. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We need a checklist. Two things. <laughs> Bermuda, Babinga. Add one Super more Mario thing 3. to the checklist. Oh, man, you fucked it up. Most expensive <laughs> video game ever. A rare copy of Super Mario 3 sold at the auction. A sealed copy of Nintendo Super Mario Brothers 3. The one with the... Uh, what is it? Got Tanuki. Little, yeah, mm-hmm. Tanuki. You got the tail. <laughs> if you're into that tail shit. Has become oh, the most shit. expensive video game. That's Burritos Cosplay right there. That's Burritos Cosplay right there. there. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a, that's a hot one, man. Fucking Tanuki. With Tanuki? a yeah. big old Italian Lady dick. Lady Tanuki. Oh my God. With a big old Italian dick. <laughs> so that it got you know, tail, you on, know what's tail on both you know what's sides. And he's just spinning. <laughs> tail on both sides, just spinning. Like a helicopter. Salami. Salami. Like tails? Oh my From God. From Sonic and you Tails? Want tails oh, you want now? two tails. And a oh, salami dick. Oh, wow. You greedy. Wait, you're, you're talking about, about Tails so, from Sonic yeah. the Hedgehog? Yeah, Miles, Tails. Miles? You're talking what about Miles? What was his first name? Wow. Tails? Or was it like Miles, Tails, McClouds? Or something. something like that. Miles, Tails, McCloud? <laughs> no, Super no, Mario no. 3. No, McCloud no, is right. fucking uh, oh, Star Fox. Star Fox. That's Star Fox, man. Jeffrey McCloud was Star Fox. So how much was this Super Mario 3? One hundred fifty-six thousand dollars. Fifty-six k. Was that oh, as shit. much as what? Supreme T-shirts? Two hundred fifty-three Supreme T-shirts expected to sell for two million dollars in Christie's auction. Damn, dude, that's like what, like four thousand dollars a shirt? This is two hundred fifty-three box logo shirt? T-shirts released between nineteen ninety-four and twenty twenty. So twenty-six years worth of box logo T-shirts. Oh which shit! Is I didn't standard. even know they were around that long. What the fuck? Yeah, it's been, been a while, man. 1994? They've been using Helvetica forever, wow. man. Wow. 
That's a lot per shirt. That's interesting. How much is that per shirt, Gemini 8K. Jackson? Carry the two. 8K. Per shirt? Per shout. That's crazy. It's kite. What but the fuck? I think as a collection, it's worth $2 million. Yeah. It's an art piece. But you can't break it apart, right? That's like... It's no, like someone's going to dead sock it, man. What? They're going to buy this shit and shirt. It, dude, oh my day. God. This is exactly what's going to happen. Check this out. Some fucking Instagrammer is going to buy these shits for $2 million just to wear them one every day. Oops. For Instagram. For Instagram money. Yes. Influencer wow. money, dude. And they're going to make... That's crazy how that They're going to make three man. million. That's crazy. By dumping $2 million of dollars in shirt. Oops. Got mustard in my 96. Toss. Or some uh, rapper. Don't give me $2 million. Some SoundCloud rapper might do that. I might get famous. Don't give me $2 million. I might get famous. You might let moose lick your cars. Canadian officials warn drivers not to let moose lick their cars. <laughs> Why? But let a thirst trap enter their house. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> <laughs> that was a bad time. I mean, that was too strong. <laughs> no, but I don't know why. It doesn't explain why. This is slow news um, right here. Yeah. yeah. Martha Stewart? I can't Let's go to Martha why, Stewart. Let's go. No, I was still talking about the moose. <laughs> oh, the moose? I don't know yeah. why there, man. I found this and I can't remember why. Oh, oh, oh I know. Oh, why. wait a second. Because they lick the cars because they like the salt that... No, I know that. that I know why yeah. the moose do it, but... Why oh. should they not be doing it? I think because their tongues they'll get, get stuck. to uh, being around cars and shit, then the car like you uh, know could like fucking fuck them up and shit. No. But they just want the salt. You can't they fuck addicted. up a moose with a car. They want that salt, man. Oh, so they're like, yeah, they're not even licking it. They're just snorting salt. They're licking it, but it's so free cold that their tongues salt. get stuck they're to the car. Free basin. <laughs> Shut up. That's what happens. No, that's what the story not. said. Oh, really? You read it? Yeah, no, it's like freezing you read weather. It? So when burrito just read it. Yeah. Burrito read it also. Who's right here? And he said their tongues get stuck to the car. That's why they put the signs up. No, he didn't. He said it's so they don't get it. Did you say that, Burrito? Yeah. I didn't read it just now. Oh, my God. You need to see Damn it. Do you see how you make me look? Hey, man, you look ridiculous. Do you see how you make me look? You look like a fucking liar. Oh, I trusted you. That's the last damn time. But check this newest weird Japanese vending machine beverage. Oh, wait, what we skipped Martha Stewart. Is this? We nah, were over Martha Mar- Stewart. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool. We're good. <laughs> yeah, we're good. Oh, wait. Uh, Before we move on, just one thing about Martha Stewart. Tits? Nah. Yo. Burrito. True or false? True. Thank you. You're correct, sir. Yeah. You are correct, sir. So the weird Yo, Japanese. 2021 is looking great for you, man. Not, just not remember, after like, we, only, we only got oh, till six. Oh, yeah, not because until I'm, July. I'm terrified of her. And what? if I and said you could never no. refuse her. <laughs> I said no. I'd be I'd be worried she would like shank me or something. Is it oh, she's not gonna shank you. No, no, shank, no. Man. no she's oh, gonna okay. shank you. Would be, yeah, you'd like get my, my you body would pegged. never you be. You are the one who's getting pegged. You're getting pegged, by <laughs> and that. then she's gonna make you into a meat pie. Yeah, <laughs> she's pegging you into a meat pie with a 27. <laughs> inch and this guy's got a fucking massive sensor. fear boner. He's got Tail. a fear boner, and it's ripping apart at the seams. <laughs> boner, yeah. be careful. The That's your last boner ever. The fucking skin's already separating. The epidermis Ew, is done, dude. done. There's too much muscle fiber below. He's got it's a, like triple, lava. a triple uranium cock ring at the end, so Jesus there's no way it's going Christ. away. Oh, my God. It's multiplying. Dude. The dick fibers are multiplying. Then and she gets a bobinga bat. Jesus. Is this like some type of weird Marvel Universe type shit going I think on? This is like season four of Baki. This is burrito. <laughs> <laughs> and he's laying down on a milking table <laughs> with a... Triple uranium cock ring, just like, and it's just like, I don't Pulsating. know. Pulsating. It has its own pulse. It's like six times its normal size erect. <laughs> yeah, it's got a separate pulse. It got its own heart system now. It's got its own circulatory system to keep up with the load. Damn. Oh, that man, fear boner is intense. Man. But I don't understand hey, how you got onto a milking table if you have a fear boner. Yeah, man. He no run. table can handle a, a fear boner. <laughs> <laughs> he runs towards fear. He's using it as a weapon now. Your your hate has made me stronger. And so has your dashi fish soup made with Coca Cola. Is that what this thing is? Mm. Yeah, dude. Coke dashi fish flavor? Does it taste like dashi? Maybe it's a little both. Is it warm? Uh, Uh, I guess that could kind of make sense if it was like warm. Dashi fish soup? I think it's just dashi from Coca Cola. Yeah, it's more like a soup. Yeah. It's just like a flavor, yeah. yeah? You could put anything in a can. How would you describe dashi to someone that's never heard of it? Salty, <laughs> pussy, sour, seaweed. Yeah, like kind of like pussy. 
a little bit acrid. I mean, you can't just say seaweed tea to somebody and expect them to see. I said seaweedy, but I can see how. uh, Like, that doesn't explain how it tastes. Nah. It tastes like pussy. (laughs) Say it. Just say it. (laughs) Chicken fries. Pussy on high tomato. Say it. New phallus sculpture appears in Bavarian mountains. <laughs> yeah, but, so we're not going to talk about what through Do- the Dashi's suit tastes like. Yo, we're so going to talk about this phallus sculpture. Okay. <laughs> Tell yeah. us about it, man. Is it a 27-inch uh, tail? Just days after a large phallus sculpture mysteriously disappeared from a Bavarian mountainside, a similar wooden carving has appeared in its place. <laughs> So we're about to get into the monoliths. So this is like no, a yeah. parallel pause, story. Guys, pause. Before we go any yeah. further, new dick who dis. <laughs> <laughs> new dick who dis. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's up, man. So anything special about this phallus? Like, is it just an art installation? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I feel like it's all these things are appearing because of the monolith that appeared in Utah. So tell us about this that's, monolith. That's now gone. Yeah, so this monolith just More kind like of More like Yeah. <laughs> Donolith. <laughs> I fucking need to yeah, write this... headlines, somebody. These people went and... What you mean, and... you people? <laughs> 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 what, the Bureau of Land Management people? I don't the know. BLM? These, uh... The government? Yeah. What do you yeah, mean, the you people? people? The <laughs> when you talk about BLM? Doing stuff. Bro. And they saw and what they a bad saw this monolith. Yeah. And they saw this <laughs> monolith and they were like, that's weird. And then Man, that monolith's crazy, dog. <laughs> and and then people found it using Google Earth and they were like, this was erected like, like in 2016 or something like that. Yeah. yeah. And now it's, so it's been there for a while. But that yeah. one's monolith. Then, then they Dude, found yeah, another these, one. How much did it weigh? Found another one in Romania. Not much. Oh, okay. Yeah, then another one appeared in Romania, and then and I then think it went gonolith. California, another one in California. Then it went gonolith. Wait, are we fucking serious here? I'm just fucking freaking out right yeah. now. Gemini Jacks is just catching up. I didn't, I didn't watch the news <laughs> at all, and now I'm Have like, you not been reading? I'm, no, no like I haven't like been. New, I never do. I'm tuning into Slam like City News right now. Why? Why are you freaking out? Why? Why like a new news article every Why couple days. Out? Like I'm oh, tuning hey, into one. new into Slam City News right now for this shit. We got motherfucking aliens at us. That we doesn't bode aliens, well. Man. Probably not. Oh. Yeah. They've been determined yeah. to be art installations. By what? Yeah. Like a community. But community. Uh, community of aliens. It's a Reddit See? thread. See. A community of aliens. You Red motherfuckers aliens. trying to lie to me. These uh, four dudes uh, a couple a booth? days ago went a booth? and knocked it over. Nah, not these four dudes. Nah, man. Don't fuck no, we uh, gotta activate that, that shit and go back. Don't, don't, go go with with that. don't put that shit on us. Four other I'll, dudes. I would lay down in front of it and make it look like my dick and take a picture. <laughs> or I'd like spread if, my if legs. If you're seven foot 18 inches. I would spread my legs and make it look like my dick and take a picture. You need to sit your little sexy ass down. Or I'd like to try to That's jump a, into the air uh, and like go prone and make it look like my dick into the ground. Plank it? I would plank it and make it look like my dick. So is there anything special about this monolith story other than that there were three that popped up around the world and they all gonolith? Yeah, they're all gone now. Probably. It's just a mystery and there's just a bunch the of people. The one in Utah are gone. I don't, yeah, I don't think anyone's actually claimed that they were the ones who put it up originally. I think maybe they're trying to like see how long it would take the government to find it, like a dead body. Mm. So this is like the lead maybe. time. This is a lead time indicator because that's a very obvious sign. So they yeah. have at least three years or four years or whatever it was. Smart. Because the, the amount of work to put that gauntlet up would be similar to burying a body. If not, it was just harder. a couple pieces of wood, actually. A body's just yeah. a person. That's my conspiracy theory, and I hope it spreads like wildfire. FAA finds Philadelphia drone pilot and YouTuber one hundred eighty-four five hundred. How do you say that? One hundred eighty-four thousand five hundred dollars. Thank you. Hopefully, he gets a GoFundMe going, or maybe he gets those YouTube hits. Nope, that's just not change. that much. Plus, he already said he's, he he doesn't make any money. Yeah, does was it for he the love in, of the game? Was he in government government airspace? No, he just didn't have a license to operate this thing. Oh. And he uploaded all these videos, so that's evidence. 
Fucking pervert. <laughs> <laughs> Much like first look inside Super Nintendo World, which opens in January and next February. Yo, that shit looked dope, man. <laughs> which opens in Japan next February, not that January dope, next dude. February. <laughs> it's cool. It looked cool. Man, I don't know. It it, cool. Do they call it Famicom? Oh, oh wait, are they gonna open one in America and call it Famicom Land? Is that what they're going to call it? That's hot shit jokes, if y'all know what I mean. You know, it'd be cool if they had legal weed here, but they don't. In Japan. Speaking or, of, yeah. Speaking of legal lawsuits, a lawsuit claims that the Mexican beer Tecate T-Kate. is actually brewed in Holland. That seems uh, like too many steps to make shitty beer. <laughs> yeah, why is, it, uh, why is it being made over there and then getting shipped to Mexico. The, right, the yeah. It goes a lot closer than... The brand was apparently purchased in Amsterdam oh. it, by Amsterdam-based Heineken in 2010. Yeah. Oh, I there you go. Yeah. I think I knew okay. that. They're, so they're alleging that they're brewing it at the Heineken factory? I guess so, yeah. Mm, scandalous. I Sometimes I want a Heineken, but most of the time I don't. There you go. You heard it here first. I don't, usually, I don't usually want a Heineken. You don't like, like them green you, you know, like, like Sometimes they think about them like it could be... But then I'm like, oh, no, I see what you're be, saying. It's not going to be what I want. I thought you were saying that sometimes you just want to drink a Heineken, period. No. Yeah. No. You're like, you've convinced yourself that you want a Heineken. And then when you drink it, you're like, nah, I didn't want this in the first place. Yeah, I didn't want this. Didn't More want like Beineken, you know? <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> I know what you're saying. So, Burrito, uh, you got that Cowboy Bebop yeah. vinyl. I recently. did. I, I, I got the Cowboy Bebop vinyl. And I think today. Tonight, uh, you Uh-oh. got at some point. Uh oh, no, 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 you got to pre-order Dying. another one. Oh, it's uh, the Evangelion. Damn, Finally, shit, Damn, album. Son. When is that dropping? When out? is that dropping? Uh, I think it's tonight. Actually. In a few yeah. hours. What does yeah. your bot say? Shit, you gotta stay up, man. You got bots. I just you checked. It just sold out. Oh, I think it's I think it's nine p.m. Pacific time. So. Just check your bot, man. So I got, got a I, couple I think hours. I gotta be up at like, you got like two yeah, hours. Eleven. I, I don't think the one at Milan Records is limited. So, oh. yeah. But the other, I think there's uh, four others, four other places. Same as the as the Cowboy Bebop. So I think it's like Newberry Variants. Comics, Right Stuff Anime, uh, Mondo, and Seven Eleven. Another one I can't remember. Or Lawson's. A no. P. <laughs> the Lawson's version of this album. But but that's, but I, I, that's I like the one the, I want. I like the Milan Records. Um, uh, it's like hot pink colored, mm. so it looks pretty. I'm nice. just gonna get the one that's unlimited. Yeah. So yeah. you're about the physical vinyl. Are you about any of the singers on this on this album? I don't know. I I think they th- there is something that got changed. It's not the original. Um, Fly me to the moon, Boo. which is kind of annoying. Me what did you just say? I said Fly me. Oh, to the moon. <laughs> I thought you did. I really did. did. Six Yo, is it fried really or, or, or oh fried God. rice? <laughs> <laughs> you plick. Bullshit. <laughs> Love me so you'll be ordering this vinyl and updating us next episode? Yeah, I, w- I will. I, will. Yeah. I, I don't think it ships until like February, so it'll be a while. February or Jan- January and February? Yeah, I th- I, February and January, maybe. Oh, shit. But by that time, your Mr. Donut ice bar is going to melt. Damn. Bro. Hell yeah. Because Mr. Donut is coming out with an ice cream oh. bar. Yeah. Oh. That's evil. And it looks good as shit. Talk to me, Mr. Donut. Talk to yeah. me, Mr. Donut. Is this a filled donut or is the whole th- is it just flavored ice cream? What are we looking at? It's a it's an ice cream bar that I think is flavored like Mr. Donut. Damba. I can't remember. Does What's Mr. Texture? Donut? Did you guys tell me this before? I forgot. Yeah, it's the best donuts in the universe. It's a donut chain and Asia that uses rice flour to make their donuts. And it's hot shit. It's I might hot. just be making that up. You I had think it. you are, but it's hot shit. I, you had I've it? had it. You had it? I had it. I ate it. Motherfucker, you had it? I had it. He's Your a globe trotter, thing? man. I trotted a globe. Ew. Ew. But he didn't okay. bring his wearable grocery <laughs> bag. It says, in honor of the donut shop's upcoming 50th anniversary, this Japanese food producer, Morinaga, Mm, is mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, oh, Mr. Morinaga? Donut Ice Bar. Yeah. I would eat this. It would be 
Oh, it released it uh, November 16th. That was someone's birthday. Oh, hey, thank you, Mr. Oh, Donut. We didn't get it for thank you. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Donut, for releasing it on my birthday for something it, I will it, never get to Why taste. did you get it for him, man? Yeah, you asshole. Piece Based of on shit. Selling Angel Cream Donut. This looks delicious. Yeah, Angel yeah, Cream man. Pie. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, dude. It looks pretty good. Sorry we can't eat it. Yeah, me too. Y'all pieces of shit. <laughs> shit, man. There's a shortage on dry ice, you know. It's gonna, you know. I don't care about I'm just that. Saying, I'm just saying, man. The dry ice is gonna I live in the lap of luxury. I live cold. in the lap of luxury. That's Fox Shots conspiracy, man. Jesus. Oh, shit, man. Dry ice is from the shortage. Put it in a Yeti. A Wait, Yeti? Do you think I got Yetis? Got Chetties. So how oh are we carrying these ice cream <laughs> bars out of here, out of this Japanese store? In our Chetties, dog. No, in your story. Oh, in Edward Tiempo's story. The ticking what? time, Vanito. How you're gonna? The ticking time. So you're just gonna use like vector or have Mr. Cleo stop time or whatever, and you can get these ice bars anytime. I do. Wait, not you guys doing this uh, stop motion porn just shit? Stop <laughs> this time. Is that rule thirty four? Huh? Rule thirty four. What are we doing? Motion. Stop motion. Hey, you just rewind it later, man. It's like a magical watch, and then like you can just do anything with her because she's frozen in time. Would she you describe that as a wearable grocery game. bag? Hmm. Would you yes. describe that as a wearable grocery <laughs> bag? That's the name of that move. His, his wearable <laughs> grocery bag. <laughs> I'm checking this out. It's oh, it's not. just like um, it's clever. It's just like a it's like an apron fucking, with holes, yeah, an apron. and you can yeah. like, put all your stuff in it and move along. Nice man. It makes sense though because it, it frees cool. your arms oh, yeah. up. Yeah, I mean that's fine. But what if I'm I need to carry like a I mean a watermelon? I guess it's, it's because bags, plastic bags. I'll just, just carry can. like other cool things Are in those pockets and, and instead you of my groceries. So. Well, they're not outlawed, I guess, but you have to pay for them. And so. And fuck that. Yeah. Asians are too cheap for that. So, do you think those would sell in Slam City? Because, no. you know. Fuck no, man. No, Someone's going to teep you in the right. chest and your yeah. fucking shit's going to break. And you're going to fucking slam fucking mustard go in your place. tummy. Here's some Slam City yeah, trivia man. for you, burrito. What is your official grocery bag? That's not going to stop bullets. What's your official grocery bag of Slam City? Well, it's sure as hell not condoms. <laughs> is it not this vest, I guess. It's not the vest. Foxtrot definitely knows what it is. Can he remember, though? I can't remember. <laughs> Gemini, refresh his memory. Wait, if he knows it, then I don't know it. No, I he don't know, know it. it. Yeah, so what's your know answer? Now I don't think I know it. <laughs> oh, shit. I think no, you just dude. forgot. The, the official Selena bag. bag. <laughs> Oh, what? the Selena, the Selena <laughs> reusable bag. Oh, the <laughs> Selena bag? That one, the yeah, Selena reusable that. grocery bag? Yeah. That's, that's the official one. That's, that's the official one for the Slam City. That's for like the, the bourgeois. <laughs> yeah, that's that's, that's where I live. Bag. I'm, I'm sorry, that's where I live. The people in the Beta Curtain District, when they oh, go to okay, a yeah. convenience store I know or something, what it is. they put their items in a plastic it's a black bag. Shit. It's a black plastic it's bag. It's a black plastic bag. The black plastic bag. You know it for a fact, Foxtrot. Because that's yeah. your favorite bag. No, that's not my favorite bag. Well, stories. The, um, a paper bag is pretty fun, too. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know? True. Usually be drinking beer or something mm -hmm. with that, you know, on the street. It's fun. So tell me about these Oreo cookies. Oreo cookies, man. Uh, Lady Gaga is coming out with some WAP Oreos. Oh, why is, this, why is she... <laughs> no. She got jumped into that universe. Huh? Yeah, she's calling them her little monsters. Wow, you know it's Oreos, more so like more like Boreos. <laughs> Damn, dude, are you against Oreos too, dog? He's just I having don't a really bad care day. for them. I like Oreos. Very like rarely cool. will I like. I would, I would, they're eat Oreos. the same, right? But I never buy them. These you never mind. They don't like like turn me on. You know what I mean? They look bright. They're not sexy really? to me. Oh. But maybe Dang, the Lady man. Gaga ones will taste like watermelon. What did you used to eat that was bad then? Ice cream. It's always been ice cream. <laughs> yeah, it duh, will forever be course, ice cream. But you never like got nailed on like, like Chips Ahoy cookies. Like with milk. Okay, those are just as good. Yeah, yeah those are just yeah. as like, you know. But like, and but like, soft ones. But uh, the soft ones, Oreo yeah. is a completely different experience. I like the it different yeah. experience. Is it because you didn't have fresh milk? No, I have fresh milk. Because it's bomb with fucking fresh ass milk. Like it's cold like, it's fucking like whatever. fresh milk. Dang, dude. Yeah. Really? Does yeah. that break any uh, world records? 
forward slash one. Sacre bleu. French pizza maker sets new Guinness World Record. I think I saw a show where they set the other one. They did? Yeah, but it says, <laughs> when I first set a pizza maker in France had broken threshold of Guinness World Book of World Record for most variety of cheeses on pizza, I thought, well, that's got to be like 70 cheeses or something. God, what? Guess how many cheeses it was, though. 69. Higher. 420. Lower. I don't know any other numbers. <laughs> <laughs> 254. 254? Jesus? Jesus Christ. Did they actually, like, measure? Jesus. Did they actually measure? Did they actually measure? Did they actually measure? That's you have one to remake them. the pizza for them. <laughs> Dude, when you when you said that, my stomach hurt. I was like, I don't know no, if my stomach not... can take 254 no, things it's, of cheese. I think it's, it's, all the same amount, it's the same amount, it's just different cheeses. Like, it's the same amount of pizza cheese on the cheese. It's just yeah, different. all those cheeses, man. But it's, it's just different ones. It's not a lot of cheese. It's the same amount of cheese. But it could be. It's not, though. It could be flashlights for headlights. It could be flashlights for headlights. That's what I was thinking. Oh. Well, driver was busted for using oh, flashlights funny. as headlights on his car. That's so fucking funny. <laughs> Again, oh my Gemini Jackson's God. learning the news this week because he's been <laughs> this is better. in the quantum and I feel like this is better for me, for sure. I love this shit. That's awesome. This is good, right? That's fucking hot shit. Hot, man. That guy this is fucking hot. Man. That's my hero. I hadn't seen this story. There goes real, my dude. hero. He's ordinary. With a flashlight, man. Brilliant. Sacre bleu. And finally. Man's wife sells his PlayStation 5 after she discovered that he lied and said it was an air purifier. Hey, I can see where it could kind of look like air purifier. It was, though. Those things are big. Has she ever breathed in PS5 air? I don't think she knows what See? that type of air is like. Exactly. She was. That's rare not air. Man, yeah, she better save her life. Man, I want to see this dumb bitch. Jesus. <laughs> I need to sit your little He's sit hoping she's oh, ugly man. so that this guy's like both got his PS5 thrown away this and story has not gonna have a it's fucked up because he bought that with their money. And he told her why it was is it, an air why is it there? Maybe it's his money. It didn't specify that. You can't assume. But that's what I'm saying, money. man. Maybe maybe she's fucking but you know, I'm saying the news stories. I'm yeah. saying that maybe he lied and said I'm buying an air purifier, and she's like, "Okay, that sounds good. that sounds perfectly reasonable." And it's a PS5, and he's like, "It's purification station five, baby." <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That sounds perfectly great, dude. Yeah, but she's like, "No, I put it in the internet, and you're lying to me, and I hate Bullshit. you for doing that." Are they in a country where? They, um, actually, I'm not even gonna say it. that. Sounds so yeah. bad. Yeah, I'm you, probably, stop myself. you probably should say it. No, what? No, I don't want to say it. I lost it already, man. I don't want to say it no more. Say it. Yeah, I don't want to say it no more, man. Should. No, I don't think I should. <laughs> I don't think I want to say it. I true or it, false? True or false? Um, Fly me to the moon. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wait, what is happening, oh dude? Oh, my God. <laughs> what is happening? And that <laughs> was the news. Food truck fanboys, you haven't lived until you've conquered the crazy one. Intergalactic Boba Runner Booba Get serves you everything. everything. The crazy one, infinite calories for a not so infinite price. Best bring your appetite because the crazy one has everything. everything. No substitutions. No. Don't give up your much earned cred by asking for no pickles, no onions. Booba won't hold the mayo because it wouldn't be the crazy one if it didn't have everything. everything. Next time you have a craving for clout that will get your feet wet, find the most badass food truck in the galaxy and order the crazy one from Booba Gets. I'm Booba Gets, and I gets it. So get it. What I have for lunch? Who's got one? I don't have one. Mm. I made it at home. Oh shit, Boomchi! Okay. You made it at home. It was it was uh, pretty quick, Boomchi. Mm-hmm. I had to defrost. Well, everything came from the freezer actually, because I put it in there. Was it peas? <laughs> I'm not giving good clues right now. <laughs> uh, let's see. Hold on. You're Hold also on. not saying Boomchi. Boomchi <laughs> against the law. Moo. Boomchi. Pizza. 
Boom chi. Hamburger. No, I said boom chi. Well, okay, I could see where. Okay. Pizza. Boom chi. Oh, lettuce. like a boom chi mustard. He said boom hamburger. Chi hamburger. Mayo. Hamburger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For one tape. Did you say hamburger, dog? I did. I did. Hamburger. I did. I did. Dude. So he you got it, but I didn't hear it, man. This is from the <laughs> freezer, though. So you defrosted some ground beef and made a real burger? No, no, no. It's already uh, like Costco it's really patties assembled. or something. What? I don't know. The yeah. Costco patties in the bag? Oh, okay. Yeah. But the burger's They're already assembled. cooked. They're already cooked. Yeah. So oh, I only like, put them in there for like a minute, two, two No, the Almuda? Ooh. Yeah, man. Balbuda Costco burgers. Always. You could probably sell Always. that for sixty nine dollars and four hundred twenty cents. I probably could, but it's so good, I'm not going to. Why would you live Shit. that life, baby? That's right. Um, I had yogurt. No, <laughs> more like no gurt. Okay, you had Chobani. No, yeah, Chobani. More like All no right. Bonnie. Oh my god! Boom! God, you got no Bonnie? Lions. That's a that's a that's a pretty Boomchi Lions. Uh, that's a pretty bad clue. Wait, were you, you at Tiger Mart? No. Did you get hot dogs? No. Or something? Boomchi French wow. bread. Oh shit, Boomchi. Did you have Panera? No. No, no, no. Boom-chi. He had the uh, a Viet sandwich. No? Uh, no? Mm. no. What's your third clue? It was fast. Fast, like Boom Chi, almost unreasonably fast. Oh shit! Yeah, Jimmy John's. I did. Boom Chi. Wait, what? Are the, what's what? What were the lions? Jimmy John's a big game hunter. Oh man, that's that's a deep cut. <laughs> well, sometimes you gotta throw off the scent, man. Sit your little sexy ass down. Fox Russell got it, didn't he? He did. I got it, dude. There you but go. with, because of the motto. The motto. Yolo. Yeah, but that's why. That's why we play the game. What's that's the point why we of play giving the you the fucking? That's why we play the game. There's no point. There's Who's no next? Point. <laughs> Boom chi. I'll go. I'll go. Um, so I had uh, okay. Uh, Boom chi. I had breakfast for lunch. Oh, pancakes. No. A Denver uh, omelet. Boom chi. I made it in the microwave. Boom chi sandwiches from J- Jimmy Johnson's. <laughs> uh, Boom chi. It's a grain. Boom chi. Boom chi. Oatmeal. 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 Close. More like throat meal. <laughs> <laughs> Boom chi. Um, Close. It's um, steel cut oatmeal, you fucking heathens. <laughs> <laughs> hey, tell me what's the difference. It's the it way the grain from the steel, dude. Because rolled yeah. oats are what you're oh, used yeah. to. Yeah. But steel yeah. cut, they're, they're like rollers. Roller. With rollers. rollers. Yeah. Like you, you, gotta, you gotta cook those steel cut oats kind of a long time, I think, right? Guys, I don't eat oatmeal. Neither do I. I, I eat oatmeal, but I it's fucking load that shit with good shit, man. Lunch. Dude, you got to try oatmeal, right? Yeah. You got to put creamer instead of milk. Oh. Yeah. All right? You so put creamer instead of milk, right? You I, get brown sugar, right? You put that on top, right? And then you put fucking blueberries, and then I you think, put bananas in there. I think there. burrito's got a recipe Dude. for us. Shit. Boom chi. Oh. Boom chi. No, what, give us your fucking throat meal recipe. Oh, I didn't have oatmeal. <laughs> But you you're had throat meal. Like you have a, a recipe. So there was had, grain in it. I had cream of wheat. Oh. What is cream of wheat classified as? He's like as? 70 years old. What is that? Yeah, for Burrito, I forgot you, you were 70. It's Wait, almost like you, a powder. Hold on. Hold on. Did you like buy this or did you find this at work? No, it's just <laughs> instant oatmeal. I have it at my house. Yeah. See, you said oatmeal. Dude, I eat Velveeta like a monster. You said oatmeal. oatmeal. You just said oatmeal. I heard throat meal. <laughs> It's oatmeal, right? So Wait, you actually it? went to the store Is and bought oatmeal? cream of cream wheat? wheat? Yeah. You went to the store and bought cream of wheat? Yeah. For what reason? Dude, it's the package. It's the old <laughs> one, like that yeah. old, like orange. like. It's thing, a yellow whatever. box with a red label. Or yellow, like, like cream what is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's, it's the red box. With a yellow it's a red label. red one, right? And they form a V. Jesus Christ. V- oh, Jesus. <laughs> it's Vector, man. <laughs> this entire nah, time. Uh, I, actually, I put some uh, granola in it. I put the cream of wheat. You mean no nola? I sprinkle some granola. Ooh. I put oat milk in it. Man. Jesus. There's a lot of grains, man. And then you you heat that up and then you pour some uh, maple syrup over the top. That's real good. Does this result in poo for you? I'm not going to lie. That sounds like an incredible amount of work. It's like four ingredients. You have to like get oat milk. Yeah, I I use oat milk instead of milk. So, so. Oh, all the time? 
Like yeah. that's what you okay, okay. We were See, just talking about expired milk. Oh no, milk so, doesn't expire like regular milk. So you can keep it in like your cupboard? No, no. you can't keep it in what does okay. oh, what does it taste like? What does yeah, milk no, taste so like? What, is I was what I was thinking is you don't I, I thought you just get milk, you know, from time to time. I don't like regular Not like milk. Your, that's like your staple drink of milk variety. That's so yeah, you get I, you I, always I, get oat milk. Okay. See, yeah, I thought you went out of your way to get oat milk for this recipe. Have you ever tried goat milk? That seems like a lot. Goat milk? Throat milk. Oh. Wait, are you saying oat or goat? He's saying throat. Same throat. Oat. <laughs> oat or goat? Throat. Oat. Like, he's really saying oat. Oat? Yeah. Throat? Oat, oat, milk. Throat? Oat. No. Goat? Goat's oats. All right, Arthur, what the fuck did you have for lunch, Mike? I had leftovers. Was it throat milk? <laughs> no, it was oh, wings. Boom, boom three. Boom three wings. Drive through. You're just reminding Gemini of his dinner that's oh, yeah. all cold now. <laughs> it's fine. I got a Balmuda. I live that life. It's like going back in time. Mm -hmm. That's the way, like, we already discussed that. But go ahead with your boomchi. Boomchi, it was a side that normally comes with fried chicken. You have French boom fries? Boomchi, mashed potatoes. It wasn't mashed potatoes. It wasn't French fries. Mac it's like and the cheese? other boom standard. Boomchi, um, green beans. It's made out of flour. Oh, biscuits? Boomchi, cornbread. Gravy. Yeah, it was biscuits. There was no gravy. Sausage. I just used an ingredient that we talked about earlier that doesn't spoil. Cheese. Oh, oh cheese. Oh, honey. Yeah. Honey. Yeah. Honey butter biscuits, huh? Dynamite. Pretty much. Ooh, fuck just yeah. leftover. Fuck yeah, that sounds delicious. I didn't have an appetite today. I'm fucking hungry, same. man. It's so late. It is really late. Sorry, dudes. Um, I should have ate earlier. That fuck. was everybody's boom cheese. <laughs> Bochi. Did anybody learn anything this week? Oh, dude, I have a, a quick story, though. Yeah, let's Tell us, that. Foxtrot. Man, I was hungry like one day, and I made lasagna, right? Were you uh, hungry like a wolf? Dude, ding, I was... Ding. Yeah, I was being a wolf, basically, right? Oh, and I was being impatient. Uh-huh. And I burned my fucking tongue with the lasagna. Oh, jeez. But I burned it like... Wait, why were you like tongue in the lasagna? <laughs> it was, like, it was dude, super hot. And he put it, it in his like mouth the, and it was it like, was like the, top, the top of the cheese. You oh, know, yeah, I got it. Like, I was like, ah, yeah. I want the and fucking... I threw it in there. Oh, Jesus. And it just got... I was like, oh, fuck. It like, went straight oh, past your teeth and down your throat. It's so hard to wait for No, no, just on my tongue. really is. But it's like a boil. Yeah. Ooh, but you suck. want that crusty cheese, man. I know that crusty cheese is fucking. You want delicious. it now. Yeah. You want it yesterday. I do. Mm -hmm. I do, man. That's all I've uh, learned really <laughs> this week. You ain't even learned a lesson this week. No, I, I actually no, I did. I did learn a lesson. No, because to you're be gonna patient. do it again next time. No, to be patient. You're gonna do it again next time. I do guarantee do it again. I'm gonna have a fucking. We're gonna have this discussion man. all over again. Nah, dude. Nah. Within six months. Okay, six months, but not tomorrow. See, I know. I never said it was going to be tomorrow, <laughs> man. That seems unreasonable. I gave you a little exactly, bit more credit. Man. I gave oh, you six months. A sexy ass down. Six months, dude. Yeah. Six months is the end of the world, dude. No, that's like seven or eight. We still got okay. December to get through. This that's is going to be December to remember. <laughs> is it? Yeah. Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> that's his Shit, ad. Man. Oh, and is then, that the campaign? He ain't playing. With this camp, it's gonna be it's gonna be our last birthdays, Foxtrot. Yeah, dudes. Damn, dude. Rip. Nah, man. We, nah. Nah. We Mr. Like, Cleo doesn't know. We got at least like a hundred years left. Or are you gonna change the future past? I don't know, man. I don't have the technology in this time. Eduardo to, uh, Tiempo. Do anything. Yeah, I we need Eduardo that. Tiempo. To, Eduardo Tiempo, Eduardo tiempo will. See? Change the He's future here. past. Are you going to change the future for us? Eduardo Tiempo will change the future past. See. Si. You heard it here first. <laughs> We're saved. The prophecy Yo, that okay. Mr. Cleo foretold may not come true. So, Eduardo Tiempo, month. did you learn any new words with your etymology study? Oh, no, I haven't. Oh, was that homework that he didn't do? No, I thought I it was forgot. just some reading <laughs> I forgot to... he's been doing. I forgot to listen to 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 some podcasty uh, stuff. A fucking rival oh, podcast. Oh, you know what? You son of yeah. a bitch! You listen to other podcasts. <laughs> He's caught on. Oh, you, you know what? Bitch. He's finally what? seen the light. I think I do remember one. Okay, no, man, so that's rude. <laughs> the word mile, right? Mm -hmm. Hey, mile. That came, oh. <laughs> that came from uh, 
uh, from the Romans who would walk a thousand paces. And uh-huh. so that was the length of a mile, right? Uh-huh. Um, uh-huh. But we have the word like Millie, right? Amelie, 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 Amelie. Yeah. Like a millimeter, right? Right. So that also comes from from that, right? Mm. Um, oh, thousand. But, uh, yeah. But our word thousand kind of also comes from that, from Latin through the Germanic tribes. Jesus so Christ. like, yeah. So like they also understood or they also had the mile, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But, and, and they understood that it was a thousand paces, but they were like, oh, well, that's just a lot of paces. And their word for a lot was like to housand or like Jesus to Christ. Yeah. And so they called it thousand or ah. eventually that's where a thousand comes from, from a thousand paces, which is a mile. Yeah. I see. That's I cool. see. Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. Word. That's what we learned this week. Anybody else? Or anything? I didn't learn shit. No. What? Well, <laughs> Let's make some money. When your hair's messed up and you look like shit, there's a solution for you. Blow and go. State of the line, South State technology. Source with the bestest Japanese technology to create the best hair dryer in the world. Shit. Even the universe. Ten levels of blow with two, fucking two hyperdrives. It's the apex of the vortex. The tsunami mommy. You can read up on the advanced features of blow and go in your own time. For now... Just blow and go. That's all you need to know. Every major department store that's worth a shit. And gas stations. And bodegas got them. Everyone's entitled to the truth. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Slam City Radio. Get in touch with us through our contact form at SlamCityRadio.com. We'll send you a sticker, then ask you where you'll stick it. Subscribe, Spotify, iTunes, Google Play all day, every day. Scram! I said sp- Oh shit. Was that too much? Hit him up! Yeah. That's him.